Fun huh? fact about this part right here. So my face against the carpet like that. Yeah. I love to steam. <laughs> my makeup because my face was pressed into the fucking floor so hard oh, wow. and so the host of the house like after we were done shooting the scene he was like oh yeah like what'd you get done doing and we're like yeah we just got done fucking in the closet and he was like oh cool cool um what the f is this i was like i'm so sorry i'll clean it i was like i'm so used to cleaning like my fucking face off of fucking things like i swear it'll be gone by the time you come back and he was like yeah i trust that it will be and i was like i'm so sorry <laughs> And one chick literally posted like, I'm about to f*** my weed, man, for this 3.5 real quick. It's about to be two of them. <laughs> the other one just wouldn't come inside. The so like, house? Just come on in. Yeah, I was or, just coming in. Oh, we got okay. my money. He's like, that's cool. I'm like, no, no, come come on in. So you had a weed? <laughs> so you had a weed, that was man. That was on You wanted to f*** him and he don't want Why you didn't want to come in? He probably got a girl. He's not yeah, a real weed, Yeah, he lived man. two buildings down and he got a crazy girl. Oh, okay. Oh, and, yeah, that, yeah, that's bound to happen. That's it. Down here is up weed. That was in West Side. Oh. <laughs> that's, a, that's, that's what you call respectable weed, man. You don't, yeah. you don't get those anymore. Those, you know? <laughs> those died out in the late 90s. Yeah, when they say you don't want to mix business with pleasure, <laughs> there you go. he might be one of them. Nah, I be getting pleasure, bro. <laughs> <laughs> mm, pleasure. I mean, she, weed she, already she, gives people pleasure, so you're already, like, you know, blurring yeah. the line a little bit. Yeah, I'm going to need a female that's comfortable with knowing that. So, yeah. Mm. Yeah, if she not, she not for me, man. But I'm going to keep selling drugs, though. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah I, I don't know if I respect it. But if he got a girl and he mm. two doors down, because mm -hmm. that might be that might be bad for you if she's yeah, she, come on, I don't fight. But if she pay, if he paying all the bills, then she should just you know shut, shut up. Shut the fuck up. Yeah, shut Sorry. shut up. Every weed man that I know that has a girl all work already think they cheating because you know yeah. they they driving yeah. around yeah. Shit. out all yeah. day. And usually they really, are though. Can't really confirm exactly <laughs> where you were. Yeah, like you yeah. gotta you gotta call it every every at every drop off. You know what I'm saying? Like make sure you ain't get shot or fucking. It's yeah. it's no in between. It's like if you ain't get shot or fucking. <laughs> that's that's it with the weed man. Yeah. But she with the latter, I guess, because she <laughs> says she's one of weed. Cool wait, cool wait, guy. is this you, if it's a sign? Wait, time out. I'm going back to something you said. You say you've been dealing with him for seven years, right? Yeah, yeah. And you say he 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 gives you dick, right? Yeah, yeah. And you use him on camera, right? I have before. And he got a girl. That's not important. <laughs> Did you hear that? Had nothing to do with me. Did you hear any of this? <laughs> he didn't live next door. He lived down the street. <clears throat> she got a point. That is not important. The I mean, yeah, that, 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 that ain't is nothing, true. That ain't got nothing to do with her. You right, you right. Yeah. That don't, is he? Like the dick he was like the do. delivery fee. Like pussy was like me paying for the delivery fee, and then I just get a little extra, and then we smoke together too. Like that's fake, I'm just saying. That that's that's very fake, yeah. to me. Salute like, him. I would fall in love. Are people too. <laughs> he making money off you. He get a nut. Yeah, and y'all smoke and, together. And, and they smoke together. Y'all relax. Y'all probably don't watch the Tubi movie together. <laughs> you probably see that nigga yeah. in the Tubi movie. Yeah. Like. Yeah, you know, he, we listen to music. He put yeah, me on the Money yeah, Man back in the day. He That's put you like, in the Money Man. Her mic closer to her. Yeah. He, he but put, yeah, he put me on the Money Man. Oh, he, he wants like, to learn how to scam. Music. Not quite. Money Man is actually one of my favorite out. rappers. So yeah. There, See, you know. and that's why I was like, I, I was, I was in the dark. I didn't know, I didn't know nothing about no Money Man. Yeah, he trying to teach you how to scam. That's what that is. You know, this is all his cool. lyrics. I, I've been listening. <laughs> What kind, of, what kind of music you be listening to? I listen to everything. I listen to trap. I listen to like lo-fi music with like no lyrics. I listen to like just like instrumentals, like hip hop. You listen to elevator instrumental. music. Sometimes I do because I I'm learning how to code, like computer programming. So I have a hard time focusing when I'm listening to other music with lyrics hmm. because it's it's the G show. So you're not listening to that Beyonce album, that country. So yes, I man. actually <clears throat> listen to country before all these other bitches. Mm. Um, I, Let it be known, she listened to country before all, all these you other, other bitches. bitches. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, I used to ride horses. Um, so uh -huh. I, yeah, I used to ride horses competitively. What? Um, so what? yeah. Fun <laughs> fact. Yeah, <laughs> like, what I did. I'm a I'm an equestrian. So um, is that what I mean? Yeah. I think I asked somebody the other day what it mean, and they told me it was somebody. It was a religion. Is that is a religion of horses? Of ri horse riders? Uh, so horse right. riders religion? I heard somebody that one time and they said a thick ass horse. I was like, that's oh not, my God. Is that, is that what that is? That's no. not what it is. I thought it was a stallion. And and that, equestrian. That's what that is. A stallion. <laughs> so an equestrian is just a person who, you who know. Rides horses, right? Yeah, rides horses, cares for horses, works in barns with horses. So like, it is just a someone who works with horses. It's just like a profession or a hobby. Like, so, if I do gymnastics, I'm a gymnast. Like, so them dudes that be jacking off horses, that's not the equestrian? 
Mm-hmm. Or the people they that, are sorry, the people equest- that be jacking they, off I would horses. say they're equestrians if they're inbreeding. Like, yeah. you're making more horses. I'm sorry, Jack. Waking up, having there's, your morning coffee. There's then morning. And there's then there are machines that do that though. Oh, you just start and they it? like sell it for a lot of money and shit. Like oh, my I family s- used to breed Frisians, which are these really expensive horses um, from Friesland. It's like a country way up in like uh, near like uh, Norway, like up I in that area. Of, I ain't never heard and, of that. Yeah, they would sell the like semen of the really really good like you know studs. <laughs> They sell, be selling nut. That's, um, that's not uncommon because when I worked for FedEx, it, ship used it. to get that in. Yep. Yeah, they used to. One one time, the shit spilled in bro truck. Like he broke the glasses oh. and it spilled in the truck. He had to clean that shit over the broom. He was mad and said, "I thought he was gonna quit. I would have quit, man. I ain't cleaning all the horse nut <laughs> at my truck. Did not sign up for this shit at all. Yeah, to clean it up. Yeah, and it got on some of the some of his uh, stops. So like, imagine you getting a swing set. You got horse nut all over the box. So you opening it up? You wouldn't. Know, you wouldn't know. You'd just be like, "Why my package sticky?" Right. Sticky. What's this white dry why is stuff? It, on why my is it wet? <laughs> why my package showed up pregnant? <laughs> oh, like, my package pregnant. <laughs> oh my gosh! But yeah, so I used to ride horses competitively, like going over jumps and like all that. Fun oh, stuff. with the hat and shit. You, mm-hmm. you, well, you have to wear a helmet. Hat. Well, not that kind. Just a helmet, like the black, like soft helmets. That's so, so crazy. That's dope. Like the pants and shit. You did that so. when you was out of Cali or out here. Up in Virginia, I was bad as fuck in high school. So they sent you to a sent, horse camp. I, well, I got sent to live with my grandparents, and they were like, "We'll give you a taste of like hobbies and shit. Maybe you will stop like trying to skip school and sucks dick." And I was like, "I don't know. I guess I'll give it a try." So, so they bought me a, a puppy. They bought me horses. They bought me horseback riding lessons. Like, they tried everything. To Who keep the hell is your grandparents? Like my grandparents no, I say, you got, you, put a shovel in my hand. I was like, "You better dig this hole." Yeah, yeah they, and they, did, they did all <laughs> they that. They did that shit too, and though. You still, you still work around still, the farm though, like yeah. shoveling horse shit and all that. Like I worked in like you know. You should do a on film the family you, farm, farm and all that shit. Like, you, should, you should do a film where you uh, fucking. I birthed a baby lamb like a couple weeks ago. I was out of the grave. Oh, you still be at you? I go, I go visit them all the time because they live in Virginia and I'm up in Maryland right now. Uh-huh. So I just go. There's an hour and a half away. I go chill with them. I was, over there baby my, lamb. I was over there chilling and then fucking the housekeeper was like, "Hey, um, was your sheep pregnant?" And I was like, "No, nah, like I, I would have known about that." She was like, "No, but like she's giving birth right now." So I literally had to like run outside in like my my nightgown dress and like fucking boots and go deliver a fucking baby lamb in the middle of the day. Yeah, I was high as fuck too. Me and her just got done blowing down. <laughs> Me and her just got done blowing down on the back porch. But yeah. The housekeeper? Oh yeah. First off she said she had a housekeeper that She only comes a couple times. <sighs> That's, just saying, but they're older. My grandparents shit. are older, so like they don't they don't keep up with the cleaning of the house themselves. They sound richer. No, they're just financially smart. How many horses they got? Just one right now. That's more than I got. I ain't mm, got no fucking yeah. horse. <laughs> <laughs> I know for real. I'd be wishing I'm one of the dogs. For real. the dogs live the best life there. Always. Yes. Always, yes. yes. But did you name yeah. the lamb after you? No, I didn't. Really? No, not this one. I, I just, had one and we didn't name him, and then we had him for Christmas dinner. It's I about to say it's funny. I His just had Phil. some lamb shoulders like a few weeks ago. <laughs> yeah. Those shit is hard Man, as fuck. Phil was delicious as shit. <laughs> Damn, <it> Phil, <laughs> His name was it? fucking Phil. That's some cold shit. <laughs> he was the only black one, and he would always escape. <laughs> you ate the only black lamb. <laughs> you ate the black. We sheep? gifted the other ones for other people to eat. Yeah, like can. Merry Christmas. They wasn't gonna eat the black one. We wanted that one. I felt like it's only Damn. right. Should have ate it during Black History Month. Oh my gosh, that would have made it so yeah. much worse. <laughs> yeah. yeah, Black Phil. Yeah, <laughs> Uncle Phil. Black Philly. Oh my god, only yeah. Uncle Phil I knew was the one from Fresh Prince. And y'all <laughs> fucking ate the lamb. That's crazy. <laughs> and he was the one who was always escaping and shit. The neighbors kept on like complaining about him getting out. So he had to go. He was trying to get to the bitches because we kept them separate, like the guys separate from the girls. And he was trying to get to the bitches. That every makes sense. Time. Lambs know what they want, man. They, the Rams be ramming. <laughs> That's crazy. So his, his punishment for being horny was getting eight. <laughs> what the fuck you get? I mean, when you I put it like that, <laughs> yes. That's usually a punishment. That's, yeah. I mean, I'll take it. Yeah. <laughs> right, I mean, like nigga, you learned your lesson. Just saying. Fuck right, yeah. to find out. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think we intro- did any introduction. Yet. We did zero. I mean, do we, we did have zero to? introduction. <laughs> I feel like we got it. Right Hi, I'm Gianna. And welcome to the podcast, y'all. Yeah. Thank you, man. Oh, Gianna. Salute. Salute. <laughs> we went viral. I brought it up. She just acted like it was nothing. She uh, said, we got a couple people hit us up. Hit me up. <laughs> Wait, what? 
Our fans be horny, bro. Yeah, I they got, be so horny. I got one message. Let me read it. it oh, was please do. I need, I need to hear this. I need oh, to hear please. this. It was like a. I think he was like an African dude. Oh, oh. yes. They know mm. what they want. He gonna serenade you with some lamb and some. Country and he music. Let, you see, he left his number and everything. Oh, oh yeah. Okay, let's go. He said. He said hi, man. <laughs> he said he's polite too. I respect him because he's polite. Okay, okay. He said hi, man. How was your night? Please, can you help me get in touch with the manager of that porn star, please? I want to join them. I oh. have a big black, big dick. And he put big twice on it. <laughs> he wrote, he wrote, you, he wrote you that? Extra big. Why he ain't, he ain't trying to get in contact with At her? least he didn't send you no picture of it. Yeah. That's usually what yeah. I would have ended up with. Well, let's not hold anything out. It was, one, it was one dude. I forgot. <laughs> I couldn't find it. He was like, he was like uh, how do I get in touch with Gianna? I got a 10-inch dick. And I was like, all right. <laughs> 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 like I'll send her your measurements like, and your number, bro. Like, like that's, bro, that's her all social I can do. media right there. <laughs> <I'm everywhere. laughs> oh my gosh! You didn't get no inquiries or nothing, especially like the midget. I can imagine um, her DMs, bro. I know they they're DMs. already Sick wild, and fucking so crazy. I'm kind of like, yeah. Like lately, I've been <sighs> legally, lately, or lately, oh, lately, I've been dodging this one specific request, and just because I'm so fucking like, I don't want to do it. And it's nothing, anything like, it's nothing crazy, but it's people who want the fart fetish. Now, I don't, I don't kink shame. I don't fetish shame. He don't. But it's one of those things that, <laughs> it's just one of those things that doing it do, doesn't turn me on. If anything, it does the opposite. Who yeah. the hell is like, that turning on in general? I can't get into the, like the act. Even I can't, it's hard for me to even act it. Just eat some at tacos. This point. Like, oh, I have a video of that, too. Eating tacos? Or? Yeah, I don't know if I posted it. I think I did. Maybe I posted it and deleted it. But <laughs> I ate, like, 10 Taco Bell tacos. And farted? Nah, I was just, like, bloated as shit. Oh, yeah, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta load up the chain, but, like, into the clip for that's some of these it. guys. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. That was all, but, like, well, hold on. You just ate the, the tacos? Butt ass naked eating the fucking tacos. So I can see some people because everybody people, already like want. the mukbangs. Yeah, they just want yeah. you to shut the fuck up and eat the tacos. I don't want you to yeah, talk. No, they they want, want you to like do that extra shit. Just eat, bitch. So you know. I mean, I, I'm pretty sure you don't do anything special when you eat unless you be like in the camera like, uh, no, no. tacos. <laughs> <laughs> oh my life, it's all over my oh, face. Gosh. Like, <laughs> no, no, I don't have any videos like that yet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I never say never. Just, never just, say never. just don't run into a fan that wants to make you the taco. Then that's when it gets like you might have shut your shit down. I don't know if you ever heard of that, but they call it the taco move. No, 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 no. It's called a chili. I'm sorry, it's called the chili dog. Okay, I'm never. Wait, mind. what? What? You never heard of chili dog in this? No. Really? Yeah. I heard about that in high school. Uh, oh, I never heard of it. I need. You. Oh, it's when you um, it's when a man takes a dump on a woman's chest. Oh, the German Shiza. That's what it's called. Is I don't know that's what I know it as. Well, she rubbed titties together and he stick a dick in the middle. And oh, chili boy. dog. It looks like a chili dog. Does it? <laughs> I mean, uh, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I was. That's what I've been told. I've never done the move. I never had a reason to do the move because I. It's not too many. Okay. Any, if any, a lot of women that want their uh, chest shitted on, but and then they dick. Then you got to squeeze together with your titties and then a dick go in the middle of it. I don't think nobody wants that, but some people do want that. Just. For future re reference, if you ever came across that, then you know what it is. I now. feel like I have to get paid a lot. But I, I do seen, it. I haven't seen it done in real <laughs> life, so I thought it was a myth. It's like not in my mouth or like anything, and I'm no, like I'm no, paid it's just, like it's just on your chest in between your teeth. Five figures. Yeah, he just he's just taking a dump on you. <laughs> you just like that's what it sounds like. like, like <laughs> you said it like, like it's nothing. What like, it like, like, squat over your chest? I've known about it for years. Yeah, they squat over you. Of course. How else they gonna get it on your chest? They all just have doodles -doo sitting and then just <laughs> put it on <laughs> <Doodle on deck. laughs> like, If I was a woman, bro, I'd start crying. I don't give a fuck. Like, I, get, oh, no, I still get paid, but I'd be crying. Like, this motherfucker's so nasty. They might like that shit. There's some people who like that shit. They like for you to cry. Like, I'm sorry. You're a different type That's of demon if you get turned on by scat anything. So, like, I don't know. You know, yeah. You know, I have a lot of scat fans. And they particularly, they don't want, want videos, though. What? What? They don't want videos. What, they want you to send it to them? Oh, no, they want to Skype live. They oh, want oh, they they to live, live shit? That, they want it live <laughs> and fresh, hot, off the fucking, yeah. What's what's the most you've made off of scat porn? I was like, it's video calls and stuff. I do like $20 a minute. And like, it takes me a second to like get it out. Like, I'm not just like a quick dumper. What if you backed so, up like, that day? Like, you can't even get it out. It happens sometimes. You gotta, you gotta fucking back? sit there and wait. 
And they wait? Yeah. Well, they, they wait like, like jacking like, off? Or? Yeah. That's crazy. Ask you questions about what you ate that day. Like, <laughs> you know. I ate these tacos earlier. Uh, yeah, shit. I'd love give <laughs> them a rundown. Like, shit. Sushi day. Men yeah. are fucking disgusting. Yeah, that's crazy. It. God yeah, damn. I've seen, like, I've seen like some girls, they say they sell like that shit. And like the dude to give them like a whole menu of what to eat that day, and I like that is insane. What are they gonna do? I don't even want to like know. They, like some dude they want to see like certain consistencies. Like eat some corn. Yeah. <laughs> like hey, I need you to eat one can of corn. <coughs> do they keep it and like some, some spinach? Do they keep it like in some Tupperware with your name and picture mm-hmm. over it or something? They shit? like they put it in Tupperware and they they seal it. I haven't done that. That's crazy. That's serial killer. Uh, like how do you levels. know? How do you know what consistency you like? You like eat three big Buford's. You I like learn. The way that look. Okay, so you learn how to make your shit the right consistency. You, like, you learn? learn. Yeah, you know your body. Like, and you're like, okay, I need to eat like a lot of fibery things. Like, you <laughs> well, know, I'm talking about the guys. Like, how do you know which one you like the most? Like, I like a nice spinach texture. Like, yeah, I like a little thickness to my like, like, somewhat a like, little girth. Yeah, I want it to all to be together and smooth, like a worm. Like, I don't know, like, like a snake, how like the snake turds. Oh. Yeah. Oh, you know who I, who I blame for that? The one, the two girls, one cup video. That's what got that a lot of niggas into that. Because that was the first one I have, I have uh, encountered. I'm that pretty sure a true. lot of people encountered. And I think that's what started that genre. Because before that, I don't think you really saw motherfuckers shitting in porn. Like, I don't know. Nah. No. Nah, that was on some random fly by night shit. I think that just made it really, wi- like, widely known that that's, that's what's going on out here. Those girls are mothers now, so... Shout out to them. I mean, <laughs> like, that's how it is. Yeah, I mean, that, that's, that that's just what it is. Yeah. yeah, that's just porn in general. Like you put it on the internet, it's gonna be there. And you, obviously, when you put it out there, you were okay with it being out there forever. Yeah, like yeah, you just so shit like, in a cup. You gotta be okay with it. Yeah, and you ate it out the cup. So. Mm-hmm. I always heard that video was fake. Also, how? Because you gotta look the way it came out. The way it came out is like quick ridiculous. As hell. Like, it, it, it like an ice cream machine. Like, oh. Nobody. Poops like that. I was I like, mean, t- unless they said horse trick, horse uh, laxatives. That's crazy. That was porn. <laughs> I respect it. It's hard to find that video now. I mean, it's not. I haven't tried hard, to find it lately. Have you? Have you looked for it? Have yeah. You? Some people, somebody wanted to see it. Somebody of this new generation had never knew what I was talking about. I'm like, you never heard of two girls, one cup, nigga. Oh my god. Like, nah. You just traumatized you. generation after generation. Hey, hey, I could have died it. with us, but no. Nah. You're passing it on. Nah, it's retro now. <laughs> it's, it's you old gotta old fucking see this shit. It's old enough to be retro I'll be now. Show it to your son. <laughs> Nah, yeah, he asked you. No, no, my son, he he finding and show it to me, bro. And I'm like, yo, 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 how you even? What? It's a time for the talk. Hey, look at this. Okay. <laughs> on God, on God, the other day he asked me what what is a uh, clapping cheeks mean. I'm like, where are you getting your information from? You're eight. Where are you getting your information from? I'm not gonna answer that. I was like, it's when your grandma see you and she just like gotta squeeze your cheeks when you're together. He's like, oh, so grandma be clapping my cheeks? Oh no! Oh god! I was like, uh, yeah. Uh, oh my, don't say that again. Oh boy, like, go outside. Uh, yeah, yeah, bro. Like this is why you need to get your ass off your phone. You gotta yeah, stay outside. You touch some grass. Don't ask me that no more, ever again. <laughs> Don't ask your mom what that means. I'm glad he asked mm-hmm. me shit like that. Because if he uh, asked his mom, she'll flip the fuck out. Was she really? Mm-hmm. Oh, my gosh. Oh, most definitely. Most definitely. It's random as hell. I feel like kids, if you don't react like in a way that's very, you know, with the exclamation point, they're yeah. usually like, oh, okay, whatever. Yeah, like, I, la- I laugh. Like, at as long as you don't stuff. react crazy, they're like, oh, anyways. Most of this stuff, when it, it I like kept, turtles. When it catches me off guard like that, I just laugh about it. Because it's funny. It's, <laughs> it's funny. like, yo, what? <laughs> <laughs> Cause we was talking about Willy Wonka and then he said that shit and I was like, what the fuck? Right, I was on his mind. Yeah, <laughs> at least he felt comfortable enough to ask. Oh, I always, so, I always applaud that for but, sure. Oh, it's not two girls one cup. Then I'm like, okay, so your mom probably showed you this, not me. It was it. It was your mom. <laughs> it wasn't blame me. it on her. Yeah, I would have to. <laughs> as a good parent, I would have to blame it on the other parent. <laughs> <laughs> That's dead wrong. That's dead wrong. <laughs> That's crazy. I respect it though, doing that. Oh yeah, 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 definitely. All right, so Gianna, what you been up to oh, since you since oh, the last man. episode? Birth and lambs, apparently. Yeah, that's crazy. God damn. I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> what? As um, far as like career wise, because I know you got up out of the city. So. Yeah, um, still like doing content. I'm not doing as much as I was like going and doing individual like collabs with people. Um, 
but mostly like events and content parties. I'll pull up and shoot some scenes and <laughs> what 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 is a content party exactly? There are different kinds. There are different kinds of content parties. There are some that are centered around just partying and okay. fucking and you know on their cell phones or they have a camera person or they run a you know big Airbnb with like multiple rooms where people can stay um and also film in and then there are the content parties where there's like a scheduled shoots like mm. you could pull up you know everyone is tested um you basically um have some, the the host of the party usually schedules your shoots for you um throughout the day there are videographers on you know you know assigned to those shoots um you have like time slots all that stuff so you're just like running around like a maniac it's like a power shoot it's like a porn power shoot it's really fun that's kind of like my favorite kind i don't you, really have to think much about what i'm doing have you ever been the one where somebody tested bad like somebody just had that shit and everybody was like oh fuck. yeah, yeah. Don't film with that. but nobody's like oh fuck but everyone's just kind of like all right, well, bye. Like, get, get, out yeah, get, get the like, fuck out of the house. Yeah, get the fuck out of the house. Like, bye. But, like, a lot of people, they just don't pull up, though, honestly, because they know that we're going to check your test. We're going to ver- verify it. That's so crazy. Um, we're going to scan, your, you're gonna scan your, your app to see that it's really you. It's valid. Yeah. There are people who've done fake tests. Um, they went and Photoshopped results and basically was trying to use that to, you know, shoot with other people. And that's unfortunately common. But it, I would say it's less common now because... Almost all of our um, porn testing um, sites use some sort of, you know, QR code verification. That's so, <laughs> so crazy. Niggas pull it up with fake STD tests, bro. That's yeah. wild. Getting kicked out of conventions, getting, Damn. you know, kicked out of content houses and like, yeah. Content yeah. houses, those seem fun. They are fun. They those really are. Fun. They are a lot of personalities in one place. So I would say the most important thing about content houses um, for the host is to make sure that you're getting personalities that mesh well together. Um, and also that you're on top of, like, the bullshit Twitter drama. Like, you don't want to get two people who hate each other and, like, invite yeah. them to an event and I've then, like, let them duke it out. Because that times. happens. It happens. It really fucking does. It makes um, good for good content, though. It should be Not hilarious. even. I wish It makes for good reality TV, which is where, <laughs> I, where I feel like that belongs. Yeah. But not as far as porn. Like, these dudes aren't jacking off to our drama. Like, they don't want to hear that shit. They just want to see fucking, like, show me your booty hole. Like, you they don't really want to know. You'd be surprised how many niggas jack off to, fight, to fighting. No, that's the thing, too. They, yeah. they jack off to that, like, you know, titty popping out during a fight, all other shit, like, you know, pussy flash, you know, all that shit. I'm not, like, crazy about fight videos, but, like, <laughs> not realistic ones. Maybe if they're, like, cat fight, like, two sexy girls, like, I maybe get into it, mm-hmm. but not exactly my thing. Um Cause y'all can have a fight and then the dudes be like, all right, now y'all kiss and make up. Now y'all have a scene. And they just yeah, tie but it never turns into kiss and make up. It usually turns into like kicking doors in, ruining <laughs> Airbnbs, like people fucking like, please getting called, neighbors of the Airbnb being called type shit. Like it's, it's shit. crazy. That's why I'm like, it's more fit for reality TV <laughs> than it is for pornography. Yeah. Um, <laughs> but um, yes, they are a lot of fun, but people get alcohol in them and. You know, jealous people and people trying to show off and you can't just you can't just fucking go home. Give like positive you know, uh, negative yeah. test results would, and go home. You would think. Yeah, you would you think would it'd be think. that simple. I man. would Keep think. My, you, I would, this I would is hope your job. So. Yeah, that's that's very true. That's very true. But that's a lot of people have a hard time with that. That's and that's kind of one of the things that I am having a hard time with, just like being in the industry. It's like a lot of people take this stuff personally. And I'm like crazy people. Yeah, a crazy people. A lot of people do. Yeah. They take it very personally, um, and to work. Like, do you really give a fuck about Susan and Cubicle Number Four next? Like, like no. Like, no, you no, don't take that no. shit home with you. Like, why no. is this any different? So, um, yeah. So I'm, beca- I'm kind of stick with my clicks. <laughs> Just stick with my squad. <laughs> we all look out for each other. We know what's up. We know what kind of you know time we're gonna be on when we throw these events and throw these parties and like. It's an easy time. It's easy to say yes. It's easy to just, you know, be able to take time out of my, you know, schedule to go and pull up and have a good time and leave with a shit ton of scenes. That's and photo lot. shoots, too. A lot yeah. of time we have, like, photographers there. I always had a question, like, okay. Well, it's, it's more a reason question. I know what, uh, like, regular porn shooting, it's always stop, 
mm-hmm. get this, yada yada, do this, stop, go, eat, take a break, eat lunch, because you know it's actual job. Is it the same thing with like? Doing your own shit, far as only fans, or you just like y'all just fucking go and you edit the, the shit you don't like out. It depends on the scene and the person you're working with. Mm. Um, some guys don't work very well with the stopping and adjusting and stopping. And you going. can't like some you no. They, yes, you fucking can, <clears throat> and yes, you can. How there are people, there are guys out here who I've worked with who are straight professionals who we will stop and get the perfect angle because we're gonna make it good. Yeah. Your dick's still gonna be fucking hard. We're just gonna get back in the same position and we're gonna go again and edit it that way but like there are some guys who you have to shoot all the way through you have to fuck all the way through and get this piece of shit fucking content and <laughs> chop it up into fucking bits and you done fuck for 45 minutes and you only got 12 minutes of usable content so mm. you know it's sometimes it's like that it's mm. amateur porn you know especially when you're you're working in a way that you're just shooting all the way through um so i mean See, I always thought that. I was like, okay, do they fuck all the way through on amateur stuff? Or, like, do they yeah. stop and take breaks to, like, the... Sometimes. The, well, sometimes you can see stuff. the chops in between. Like, <laughs> yeah, they change positions. Yeah. Or, yep. This shit be crazy. Like, hey, stop. All right, sometimes so it just goes soft and, like, we're in doggy and they're still fucking, like, still fucking you. Like, yeah. It's not even in there. No, nah, that's what I'm saying. Like, okay, do they we, do we stop like, and I go eat a sandwich and then I come no, back? No, we cut it because I'm like, we're fucking done. Can we call, can we call this scene? And you just call it a day? Yeah. Bri- we going nut. Mm. This is adult film. Mm. Okay. <laughs> Let's be fucking real. That's so wild. <laughs> not yeah. all cream pies are real. Not all fucking wait, orgasms wait, 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 are real. How do you fake a cream pie? Like literally there's nut that looks, there's a, not nut, there's lube that looks like nut. And you just throw it in there? You just kind of like use a syringe type of deal like what yeah you use a turkey baster no it's kind of not exactly like a turkey baster it's more like like you're giving a shot it's kind of like when you give giving medicine mm. like <laughs> like the medicine shot looking <laughs> things like a medicine syringe um like a liquid medicine syringe but yeah, like i know you've seen a scene where like a girl she'd be creaming and you're like all right that's too much oh yeah, yeah right. sometimes that pisses but, me the fuck I've off i've seen and it I'm like, and you it, know they're like oh yeah creamy pussy and i'm like so there's this really cool stuff called a vagisil, baby girl. And like <laughs> flagels also really flagels also probably gonna be really great for that. But that's not the kind of cream in that we're looking for. Um I don't be looking for that. No. Type of cream. Like there's milk and then there's cottage <laughs> cheese. And you got I heard know that. The I just saw that the other day, actually. Somebody just said that. So when it look like cottage cheese, like no, no she need to whoa. Yeah. Um, well and then, I mean it's natural, like, but Let's address it. <laughs> I remember I had a chick cream on my face. And I didn't know what the fuck was going on. I mean, sometimes it, I was fascinated. Some, actually, some of it's good <laughs> shit. Yeah, like, I was, I was I throwing up. I'm like, oh yeah. shit, women be nothing like us. I didn't know. Yeah, I didn't know at the time. I was Absolutely. naive. I didn't know till I knew. <laughs> but still, yeah, a little is cool. But sometimes when you look at a scene, it, it just be like straight up like. Somebody just put some Crest toothpaste down. Yeah, yeah. Like, Foaming oh. at the pussy. Like, like, she just so like, creamy. Ugh. Rabies cooch. Yeah. She be looking like, like that icing you put on um, the uh, cinnamon bun. Yeah. I don't need that. <laughs> <laughs> I don't need both eye nuts to look like that. I don't. <laughs> Twins. <laughs> So what the when they when you about to go to a contest house do they give you like a list of people? Yeah, I can understand because times... sometimes there might be like some new guys in there. Yes. Like who the hell is this guy? So yeah. yeah, so recently I've been invited to a content event like really short notice actually. Um, so they sent me the list and there was like one person I was like who is this person? Like I don't recognize them. Everyone else I'm cool with. Because a lot of times they ask you like, all right, here's everyone who's going to be there. Is there anyone that you do not want to work with mm. at all? Um, so like they can help maneuver that situation if that comes into, you know, if the person's asking the host, like, Hey, can I shoot with Gianna? And they're mm. like, Oh, Gianna has scenes set up or like to not put us in a weird situation so that the whole weekend doesn't get ruined by Dang, people's egos getting weekend. fucked up. Damn. A lot of times it's four, about four days. So like Thursday to Sunday or Monday. Damn. Yeah. I leave sore. So say for instance, like you, like you, how you said, you, you, it is somebody that you don't like. Do you just not shoot, or you just shoot with anybody else but yeah. that person? I just shoot with anybody else but that person. And mm. if there's like something like an orgy scene or like a huge gangbang where I don't really have to interact with that person, I'm cool with that. Like, mm. I don't feel like I have the type of beef with anyone where I can't be in the same content house as them. Mm. That's just not. Yeah. That's just not what I have going on. Yeah. Also, if you got a beef with somebody, they kind of know. So 
Let's say that's y'all have an orgy. The dude that you hate not gonna just come up to you and be like, I got a sense that she don't fuck with and me. It's yeah. like, but also consent though. You know for damn sure somebody that you don't fuck with and someone don't fuck with you, there's no consent there's not gonna be any consent there. So right. there's no even exactly. there's not really much question with that, honestly. But yeah, there is definitely people who pull up and they have beef and nobody knew that there was issues and you're like, Oh Lord. Um and you just kind of sit back and giggle, honestly. Because, <laughs> let me grab my drink. Oh, how, man. Uh, how, how long do those shoots normally last, like, during the day? Like, It depends on, like, how, so a lot, the, the work ethic, I think, in each person is a little different. Like, there's guys, or they're only good for, like, two scenes in a day, and then, like, they got to wait till tomorrow. There's some guys who are, like, are staple like when you schedule like when you put an event together like that you know you have your gangbang guys the guys who like you know toss them in with multiple guys they're gonna keep their dick hard they're gonna fucking perform they're going to um you know they save their nut they think they work smart they don't fucking come and nut in every fucking scene like (laughs) like they're not out here just like fucking off camera and just like wearing themselves out like there, there are professionals um so take those my guys, dick game very seriously. And yeah, they take their dick game very seriously. Um, and they leave those shoots with you know about you know twenty scenes under their belt, God especially damn. if they're working. The last, the, my my squad, when we throw our events, like our weekends end with like total out of everyone shooting like a hundred scenes over a span of like three crazy. four days. A hundred scenes, all of us end up like you know collectively shooting. Damn. So yeah, that's like good, we put in work, and that's why I was like, yeah. those are the ones that I've kind of saved my energy and saved my time for because I know I'm going to get, um, you know, what it is that I'm looking for out of it. And that's another thing too, just like going to these events with your own goals in mind. Like some of the, um, some of the ones like that have the very, you know, mainstream people who mm. attend. I already know. Sometimes I'm like, I'm not gonna get all the shoots in the world, but. These girls don't think about photographers at these events you could take advantage of. So now I'm going to take this event. This is going to be my fo- my my photo event. Mm. Like I'm going to all my downtime, I'm going to focus on photos. And when I get my shoots, I'll already be dressed and ready. And it's always about being dressed and ready. And a lot of people just like chit chat and like party and drink. And then like the chemistry naturally happens. And then they're like, all right, we want to like, come on, let's go shoot a scene. <laughs> Real quick. Let's, hey, let's get, the camera ready. Hey, get the camera ready. Get the camera ready. Hey, hey, cameraman, get the fuck over here. So like, yeah. <laughs> I know there was one event where I tried the pink pussycat pill because I was just like, I was just like at this event. And they like, got a gas station pill? I heard that shit calls heart attack. Oh, yeah, well, I didn't die. Here I am. <laughs> <laughs> so it was like, I was at this event and I was like already just kind of already antisocial. And I was just like, oh, well, it's going to help me get in the mood. Like, and it smoked. I have a little bit to drink, but if I drink too much and I'm feeling antisocial, I'm going to fucking hurt somebody. Oh. So let's not go that route. And I was just like, someone was like, I need to go to the sex tour for Blase Squaze. And I was like, oh, well, I'll just ride with you so I can get out of the house. So we get to the sex tour and I'm like, I'm looking in the little glass case. And I was like, hmm, that might be helpful. Like the guys have all these performance enhancers that they use at these shoe oh, houses. Oh, that was going to be my next question. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> oh, for sure. Everybody, yeah. I so, yeah. <laughs> Um, but yeah, and also some guys use diet, um, as What's well. That? What's that? I need, right, I need to be writing this shit. Ah, they oh, diet. they use a good diet. Like, they use a good diet to keep their lean dick meat fucking, and shit. like, nah. just like, I use the pill, right? protein and like, <laughs> you know, <laughs> protein and hydration and, you know, yeah, electrolytes, all the green things juice. like. I drink some water and, you know, <laughs> eat a gas station rhino pill. Call it a, call it a fucking week. But yeah, so I tried the pink <laughs> pussycat pill and I was just like, all right, well, this is cool. Like, I'll, I'll just try it. So I left. Pop the pill, get back to the house. And I would say it's like, and I think somewhere on the package that I don't specifically remember reading, it says like, do not use with alcohol. But I was like, that's dumb. So I drank. Because duh. And I would say about 35, 40 minutes later, I'm walking through the house. I'm like, who's going to fuck me? Oh my who's going to fuck me? And yeah, I shot I, qu- I shot quite a few scenes. Thanks, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody, <laughs> Everybody <laughs> started raising their hand. Yeah, she started roaring like Simba, like, bro. Like, like he's like <laughs> fucking thirty I, minutes. I bet the dude they were, like, um, they were like, oh, she fucking the back. Fuck? I wish I said no. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, all right, this is starting to hurt. <laughs> yeah. So that's what happens when you take a Viagra as a girl. That shit starts to hurt. I've never known that. I was work too on curious. Women. I was too curious. Your pussy got hard. <laughs> she did and that shit I was scared it's gonna last more than four hours then we'll go to the ER and then what oh my god your shit probably was sticking it hurt <laughs> so bad out. I couldn't even sit with like my legs crossed cause like just squishing my clit was like painful as fuck Damn. like I'm <laughs> curious 
curiosity will fucking kill my cat. I'm so sorry. And I know it. <laughs> my curiosity is going to be the thing that kills the cat. I've never heard of a woman taking a regular Viagra well, until now just have. now. You're welcome. Oh my gosh. I never even thought about that. Well, now you, now you can I think thought, about you know, it. It, was just, it just jump start us. I, I didn't know till just now that yep. it jump start so you, y'all you're never going to try it again. That's <clears throat> one and done? I mean, so now there's this like female one out and I'm like, I heard well, it was a maybe female one it's going to be, since it's made for me, mm-hmm. it won't hurt. Now we can start using the you can't get it up jokes, bro. Like, you, can't get your pussy <laughs> up. Like, you can't get that pussy up. Pussy is so soft. You got pussy Ooh. on soft. Got a limp ass <laughs> pussy. Limp ass <laughs> pussy. <laughs> I love pussy. Yes. It's kind of like y'all ever seen the videos where the dude make that girl do the like humping position and like and they be timing them. Yeah, the humping oh, position that they be yeah. winning their ass out. Yeah, they yes. only can last like twenty seconds. Yes. Like, see, now but, y'all know, y'all get it. Got to have a lot of upper body strength. Well, yeah. I mean. I'd be throwing dick. I'm be, like, I'd be throwing my strap on. I'd be throwing dick. Okay. And I actually have been told that I throw a pretty good dick. I was in a, I was in an orgy once and I didn't feel like getting fucked by other people. I was just like <laughs> over it. And I was like, I'll eat some coochie. I'll throw some dick. Like I'll even suck some dick, but like, don't fuck me. <laughs> um, so <laughs> I was throwing dick in this fucking orgy and a lot of girls were like, God dang. And then I did an all girls orgy and I was awesome. one of the strap girls. Awesome. And they were like, G got some good dick. Do y'all just like, rock, paper, scissors that shit? Or is just like, no, I, I just want to put like, the dick on today. So, yeah, it's like, I want to wear the dick today. Like, it's my <laughs> turn. Like, let me sit. Like, let me. Yeah. Yeah. That or just like, sometimes it's like girls on her period and not a shoot house. And like, she wants her content too. So what's she, she going to throw some dick. Oh, and like, she'll borrow someone else's strap and like wear that if she didn't like anticipate that as well. So like, she'll throw dick. But I heard, I just, I heard I got good dick. So now I'm like, I definitely have taken that. You know, to my head. Y'all heard that? Um, she got good dick. I got great dick. Wanna. And I eat pussy. Yeah, all the women. Well, I have and not the, had and any the complaints. dudes that like that. Just it, saying. Uh, Wait, which oh, part? I eat ass, too. So no, that okay. translates. <laughs> Is some of them Male guys? and female, you don't, you don't matter. It don't matter. Is it clean? A lot, of, a lot. See, exactly. A lot of people don't think <laughs> like that. Is it clean? But that's, that's literally the main. <laughs> yeah, wash your ass and I'll eat it. The fuck? Like, <laughs> hibachi. I like hibachi. Straight hibachi. Like, <laughs> <don't eat> hibachi. <laughs> <laughs> I respect it. I respect it too, man. I, I can't salute. I'm just saying. Yeah, I ain't. I ain't grown enough to get my ass ate. I, really? I respect. Nah, Still? Nah. Bro, we 35. You'll be 35. All right. What year. about the gooch? Gooch is. The Gucci man, man. Nah, I don't know. I'm not insecure. I just like saying I never tried it. So try it, man. Just you heard the rules. Like starting... It's only one rule. Keep make sure it's clean. <laughs> yeah, make sure it's like, clean. Like don't okay. let me look down there. Like we six to nine, and I look down there and I see like tissue or like yeah, yeah. that's crazy. I use wet crumbs. I'm, I'm grown. I use wet like, wipes. Bingo. Yeah, just don't exactly. touch them. Exactly. Exactly. It's bad for the environment. Exactly. Um, I, like, I learned that the hard way. I one time <laughs> I had a, a, a three hundred dollar plumbing bill. <gasps> Oh, it's your overflow? That'll do it. Yeah, you're not supposed to flush the flush. No, hell right? no. It tell you that. It's it's it says flushable. It says flushable. It's it's flushable. Yeah. Like, it say that, but they be lying. They do. <laughs> they should be sued like shit. <laughs> do not flush a lot of Do not over, flush. Bro. Flushable wipes. Unflushable. Yeah, it will fuck yeah. up your drainage system. Unflushable. Now, if it's, now if it's the bathroom here, I don't care. I'm, <laughs> it's I'm still backing up. I'm, we share that shit with like 30 times and I was regretful. I was like, ah, I'm going to switch rooms. <laughs> They'll find out. They'll find out, right? What's a bad experience you had at uh, at a content house? Oh, I love to hear this. All right, so like personally for me, like yeah. a bad, like a content house well, that didn't both, go well, like, or something uh, I've part, seen go for well you, bad. For you, do for you, and then you something you seen crazy. I would say for me, mostly um, my social anxiety used to get the best of me. <clears> um, <throat> so I would just drink, and I would get too drunk and overly drunk, and I would just be like. Too much belligerent. Uh, yeah, kind of belligerent. And I'm not a fighter. I'm definitely like a horny lover. Girl, you from Duval? Um, you a fighter? No, I don't. Really? I've only been in two fights in my life, and they were like before I got into. All right, one was in high school. One was in elementary. But Damn. That's it. Okay, never mind. Then. I'm not a fighter. I don't. I use. I know how to use my fucking words. Um, <laughs> and I don't get offended by dumbass shit. I don't take shit personal that's not directed by me. And a lot of times, people are you know, projecting their own bullshit on me and I will not allow it. And that's it. Um, so I'm not a fighter. Um, but for me, I would say that was probably the worst experience. I know like one shoot house, I got drunk as fuck the first day, 
fucking jumped in the pool. My fucking wig came off. Oh, Somebody no. said some shit, took the wet wig, threw it at the host of the fucking oh, shoe house. No. And then my friend was like, gee, it's time for bed. And I was like, okay. <laughs> and I was like, I went to bed. So I'm not like, I'm not, I don't fight. I don't. I'm like, I I'm, I'm listen. I, I listen. Why would they throw like, your wig? That's rude as hell. Fucking, I don't know. They That's irritated so my face. I don't know. They irked my soul in some way. And I was just like, <laughs> um, so yeah, I smacked them in the face with my fucking wet wig. Um, and I went to bed and woke up the next morning and apologized. And I meant it. I was like, ah, oh, that was, that was fucked up. I, I probably should have done that. And then it was a while where people would not invite me to, to their event, uh, their, to their events because they're like, she's going to get fucking drunk and do some crazy ass. Shit. Oh, um, there was, I had some other crazy shit that I'd done, you know, not anything like out, you know, blown anybody out of the water type shit, but like just being too drunk and it's just like not professional. Um, so I definitely had to like get a grip of like my own anxiety when it comes to these events and just like, you know, not not drink until, you know, the evening or after mm. I've done shooting and like smoke instead and like, yeah. you know. Smoking always helps. Yeah. So like smoking instead, catch me outside by the pool smoking and stuff when I'm out shooting scenes or I go hide out in my room and just like chill on my phone and say to myself and don't force myself to be social when I'm not feeling it. Mm. Um, so I've definitely, you know, done a lot better with that over the last like four or five years for sure. <laughs> Um, but I would say other people, I don't want to be telling people's business, but I we feel like some, stuff, some stuff's on, <clears throat> you say if it's on Patreon, I would you say, gotta, you gotta say that for me, cool. um, the most, the worst experiences are the shoot houses that have, um, I would say shoot houses that have too many it's too much, too party ish, and not focused on content. Mm. Oh, okay. Um, so everybody's drinking. Everybody feels like everyone's just like there to fuck and like, and that's when people get overly belligerent. They're there with their partners. Um, people are kicking doors down, um, biting people. What? Um, what? you know, like biting all kinds you. of crazy. Like, there's like lots of stories out here in content land. Of like just people things getting wild, and I think that that's more of like the worst <laughs> side of things. Um, I think it's always funny when the cops pull up to the fucking content house, um, oh, and like everyone has to like shut the fuck up and like <laughs> act like we're just having a regular ass party and like hide all the naked people in rooms and like Holy you know. Shit. <laughs> the cops come make in. Sure they, it's see, a regular party. they see twenty dildos. They're like, "What is what y'all what the hell is going on? on? Is this going a cult? On here? Yeah. <laughs> Mm-hmm. Yeah, baby, it's not against the law though. And there no, are some no, counties in Florida that it is against the law to shoot yeah. pornography. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. You can't shoot Polk County, outside. Can, Polk County, I know for sure you cannot shoot pornography. Yeah, Tampa fucking sucks. Um, so yeah, there's sometimes there are people I have to hide. Because they naked or the fact that they fucking? Which because people that fuck. and then also um a lot of times the shoot houses are in Orlando. The prices for Airbnbs are really affordable. You get a lot of bedrooms. You get a lot of square footage. You get a pool. um, And try not to have, like, naked people by the pool because there are other neighbors and things like that. So we're really conscious about that. Um, But definitely the noise sometimes gets up with drunk people. (laughs) Like, um, us, late, you know, drinking and fucking by the pool. I've seen one video of you a while about a pool. It was, like, on your Twitter. What was I doing? What was she doing? She was giving a dude head by the pool. She was outside. Is that wild? That's wild. That's considered wild. Is it? Oh wait, I've kind of done that a couple times. Which one? Which one? Which which dick was it? (laughs) Which dick was it? Well, I'm I'm gonna make this game. Which dick was it? Did you recognize the dick? Oh no, it was like a dick. It was a man. It was a man dick. Okay, (laughs) that's great. It was a man. You had a penis in your mouth. I don't don't pay attention to the dudes. I'll be like, oh, it's it's a man with a dick. Yeah, I've done some scenes about the women. See, I don't be knowing the dude's porn star name. I just be like, oh, I've yeah. seen him before. They're Fuck him. Familiar faces. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, yeah. Yeah, for weird. sure. There's one guy who screams his name sometimes in the middle of a scene and it's hilarious as fuck. Um, like a hat? Like, like a, a like, Oh, like a, ta- like a tag. Like he'd be yelling like at shit. Like a Pokemon? Like, like Pikachu. <laughs> town, town, slim. Like he'd be fucking yelling at shit in the middle of his scenes. And Does I, I fucking love that guy. I don't know, but he's cool as shit. <laughs> Downtown that's his power up shit. We're like, oh shit, but he's cool people. <laughs> Shout out to Poundtown. Pound Town. <laughs> Two good people. I remember one the one dude, and I don't know his name. He like he wear like do rags and he danced like he'd do the whoa. 
Like while he's fucking. Oh, oh you're talking about King Nazir. Oh, no, I oh, met him. He's at yeah. one of my first few shoot houses. I met him, uh, and he definitely played like the sun role and like shot with a lot of milfs and played that that yeah, role seen, really well. I seen him smashing the chick one time. Like her wig came off, but he put on a wig and he just kept uh, smashing. Like that shit. Oh, was King Nazir. Yeah, yeah. That yeah. Shit was crazy. Oh, I've seen one where he was fucking. Her, I think her name is oh thick ass Daphne, and mm, you know yes. she got the low cut. Mm. Yeah, and he put a do rag on her hair to tie the do. <laughs> I was like, come on, man. <laughs> like, he, br- he brushed her waves and put a do-rag on it. Now, that's care. That's intimacy. Porn like, is about intimacy. <laughs> that's intimacy. Intimacy and entertainment. Like, and entertainment, for sure. Yeah. <laughs> he brushed the waves. That's love, baby. Oh, uh, yeah. He, ain't, yeah he, he know what he's doing. <laughs> I would do the same. I have fun with it. I the same shit. Yeah. But definitely... Um, yeah, these, these shoot houses are a good time. I'm going to uh, this one. I'm going to coming up is more of a birthday party lifestyle swinger type deal. Hey. But everyone's going to have their industry standard testing done in order to attend, and they're going to be camera people. Yeah. Um, and we are very welcome to shoot and you know schedule things on our own, hmm. um, or just fuck for fun. And yeah. it's been I would say it's been some time since I've been out here just. Fucking for fun. So, you know. <laughs> fucking for the love of the, of the game. Fucking for fun. <laughs> fucking for, like, yeah, you know. Like, you know. Content. Yeah. So, and just, like, me and my partner. Like, but, yeah. I uh, definitely am looking forward to just being a slit. Sound it. Yeah. So, at the concert house, do there be people that, like, that just don't do porn? Like, they just there just to film it. Like, just mm-hmm. strictly camera. A lot, of, a lot of the camera people for these events Where's don't Where's the fun perform. in that? Some of them used to perform, um, but some people just, they, they prefer that. That's their their art, like just videography. Sometimes their wives are performers and Whoa. they are actual like camera people. That happens a lot. Um, Take a grown ass man. I ain't no my grown dude, my, dude be holding the camera. my dude be holding the camera. He love that shit. He hold the camera yeah, and be like, hey, video, baby. He be fucking me to it. They destroy that dick. Oh, that's what's up. Hey. Yeah. Hey, it works. Yeah. It works. It works. Love it. It's, it's my happy place. Yeah. <laughs> yes. I be sucking dick like my man is watching. But sometimes he do be actually exactly. watching. He, he does. Actually he watch really does be watching, watching now. <laughs> he be like, so I saw you post it on Twitter. When am I going to eat it again? Like, I'm like, oh shit, I forgot I posted that. He be, like, <laughs> be like, yo, the way you suck this dick, I, I'm going to need you to do it like that tonight. Oh, yeah. It, it ain't even ever that. It's always, that's always what type of time we on. Yeah, he ain't even like, got to ask that. Yeah, like, yeah. like, that's love. That's why I get to do what I do because he don't even got to ask that. That's, that's, like, that's love. <laughs> that is love. <laughs> yeah, salute to the content houses. So yes. last time, so we, I was talking about a little bit in the beginning of the whole viral shit with the gangbang. Uh, did yeah. you ever end up having your gangbang? Because we didn't do our I job. I did not. We didn't, we, didn't, we, didn't, we, didn't, we didn't hold up the end of our bargain. It's okay. But I'm hoping that you at least had one. I don't Maybe. think I've had any gangbangs since then. I've participated Damn. in like a reverse gangbang where I, I strapped a bitch and she was tied to like she was in bondage and like we all ran through her ass. Um, and I, I dipped her down. <laughs> that sounds lit as fuck. Um, yeah, that's my homie. My, my Savannah star, my baby. Um, but yeah, we, uh, I have not had my own gangbang yet. I feel, I feel like this is, the, I tried to have one actually. I tried to host one in DC mm. and I had lots of interest, mm. um, but not a lot of follow through and what that testing boy. Some oh, people are just scared of some pe- a piece of paper. Mm. They scared as fuck. So like, what's the, what, how many guys would you have in your game, man? As many as show up. Many as pull up. Yeah, with yeah. positive tests. Yeah, I mean negative. Negative. Tests. Negative. 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 <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but like, whoever would show up, like. So fifty dudes come with negative tests. Let's go. Oh my god, that would be up. a dream come true. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. I'd be so happy. She'd be good. Oh listen. my y'all, gosh. Like, y'all heard it. I would just sleep dudes. for a week afterward. That's all. But God like, damn. I'm going to make sure everybody's all taken right. care of. So this time around, we need to actually set it up. Let's, <laughs> like, act, let's actually <laughs> we do it. do this time. shit. We was playing around last okay. time. 
But we, we, but I know you seen the comments. There was some dude. They're, they're like, like, like yeah. yeah, the comments seemed like people would have been interested. Yeah, people just get a hotel. You know, just pull up to the game yeah, place and just, sure. just go in, bro. Absolutely, I would totally be down for that. No fluffers, just you, just. I mean, we got some fluffers, and uh-huh. like, if you want some of my homegirls to come through and fluff, yeah, like, they yeah, yeah, yeah. If my yeah. girls can get some blowjob content off of you, because we don't just be, you know, yeah. got to be usable. Everybody um, wins. Everybody wins. Like, and maybe you meet some of my fucking slutty ass friends. Um, but yeah, like, I mean, I'm down. I'm so down. Do we know 50 people? Nah. We, 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 we gotta make we friends out. quick. We gotta figure it out. There's some people, there's people on the internet. If the dude, <laughs> okay. if those dudes could do the 20 women versus the 10 men versus yeah. the little video, we, <laughs> yeah. we, we want, we could find somebody that wants some coochie or something like I that. Mean, that should I'm, be easy. I feel like, Very true. yeah. Yeah, it shouldn't I mean, be hard at all. It really nah, shouldn't niggas, be niggas that hard. Now, nah, yeah. find a niggas that's not neck, that's not positive. Yeah, that's the, that's that a, might be. That's yeah. what's stopping this shit. Yeah. It might be. They yeah. can't be from Jacksonville. <laughs> <laughs> Cannot well, be I didn't. Him. I didn't try Jacksonville, so maybe that's yeah. where I fucked up. Yeah, I know. But if you got tests, though, maybe you've been staying on top of that shit. If you have enough sense to fucking actually, it's probably like ten it. niggas in this city that stay man, on top of that shit. Man, we been pulling up the AHF lit as fuck. Excited as shit to get tested, <laughs> man. We pull up the man Taco Tuesdays. And testing we've been there excited as shit to be there the, the fucking medical assistants be annoyed as fuck I'm like it's free like free testing you mean and we get to do this shit for us free yeah. they're like do you want us to ju- draw your yes please like yeah it's a it's man a, it's giggling a hosp- in there it's a hospital here i think it's um is it baptist so down at st vincent's st Vincent. vincent's um, yeah. so down at st vincent's i That's believe I it's in the DePaul building um it's on the, I believe, the ninth floor. Ninth floor, yeah. Um, they're open there. every day except for Sunday, I believe. It's a um, particular day, though, that they do it for free. I want to say no, it's like... No, not one. anymore. Oh, they not, do it free every day? Yes. So okay. that's one thing yeah. I was really excited about. They really expanded their resources a lot. Um, if you want to get on prep, they also set you up for that. If you're not on insurance, they'll do that for free. Um, if you want to um, get tested, I would say they do the full panel... Um, for free once every four months, I think they'll do for you. <laughs> now, is uh, herpes often, test included in that? Because I know you got to get a separate test I think you have to ask specifically for, for that, which uh, most doctors do require that you ask specifically. Um, just because it's one of those things that they're like, it's not going to kill you to have herpes. And that's, I used to work in gynecology. This is that I, I was doing that up in Maryland, actually. You delivering lambs and you get to see coochie? I was seeing coochie. Like, that was my thing. Like, even, yeah, when I was here in Jacksonville, even when I was here in Jacksonville, I was working at a gynecologist's office. Oh, wow. um, actually, abortion clinic, too. Oh, um, so, yeah, like I'm for the I'm for the girls. I'm for the girls. Um, so working at abortion clinic slash um, gynecologist's office and the the amount of people who would not even think to even ask about herpes just because and the doctor would be like oh like i see you have like a couple of bumps there and she's like yeah like i haven't really thought about it and oh, she's nah. like we'll test it and they're not like even noticeable bumps noticeable bumps so they're like look like ingrown hairs or something and he's just like ah we'll test it but like there's i'm just wanted to let you know that whether you found out the result or not you've probably had this for a while and yeah, your partner herpes, already has it yeah. and whoever else like they probably already have it so just so you know like me testing you for it now isn't gonna prevent anything nor is it gonna change your sex life honestly nah they like, try to wrap it up people, like hey you know it's it's a it's, it's, it's all, like a cold sore yeah like, everybody it's not, everybody has herpes inside and that's of not them. that's not true like <laughs> but what? yeah it's not true but you yeah, know i've been noticing like people been, are trying to normalize herpes and the things i don't even but, think it's no. normalizing it i think it's just making people aware that like it's common yeah and like by making people aware that it's common it allows people who do have it to be open about it and to let people like let their partners know that hey i'm herpes positive like yeah but it's just a cold like, sore you did so yeah so basically no it's just i've been bite- seeing people say oh everybody had herpes no no nah, that's nah, different that's not- <laughs> like <laughs> that no that's true. like you're not being exactly. ignorant <laughs> now what you said was the <laughs> right point but it's the people being ignorant, like yeah. no, everybody not has. Yeah, not, yeah. Not I, has I, no, herpes. not everybody. I've no. seen people say they can cure it. They find ways to oh cure my gosh, it. I've I don't know if that's a Instagram. myth or not. I well, just drink the sea moss. What do you mean? Yeah, that's like, what they say. Drink, no. drink the sea moss. <laughs> I, I haven't had herpes in, in two years because I drank the sea moss. Sea moss every yeah. fucking day yeah. and run away. It's not real. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's real. Yeah, I believe. Yeah, right. I think you might be wrong, but. Yeah. <laughs> Okay. No, I've been to that place the same because I went last year. I remember Man, I've I love them people. Place. They're fucking great. Cool I've been going over there for years just because, like, in between my industry testing, it's, like, good to get tested. Also, partners that I do want to have sex with, like... Yeah. 
I, got I don't home. like condoms. I fucking hate them so fucking much. Like, go get fucking tested, please. It's fucking free. Raw like, dog if you is don't want to fuck me raw, like, just say that. You can go get tested for free yeah. after work. Like, you don't have to call out. Like, they are even open on a weekend. Like, you have no excuse not yeah. to fuck me. I, <laughs> like, I don't take this goddamn gas station pill. Fuck me. I didn't take this goddamn. gas station pill for nothing. <laughs> I know some people fuck that. Fuck a raggedy ass condom. Like, God. Yeah, it's like eating a, a Snicker bar with a wrapper on it. Come you on. You don't do that. Come on. You know, I love raw dog. Come but, on. But uh, I've, I've met, I know somebody that actually, you know, he don't, he go to get tested. If you see a fired chicken, uh, like, he. That's the right place. Ask her results. That's I mean, the at least, place. At least you know they safe. At least you know they good. You Ooh. ask for their results. And if they feel comfortable telling you, you be like, oh, okay. Oh, well, I need to meet What's your person. number? Does he want to attend my gangbang? I could ask. No, you totally should have asked. <laughs> You should totally ask. Just for me. You didn't write with you. Know, like, hey, you, I know a hey, young lady. Yeah. She got a gangbang. Yeah, you want you know. a pussy and a gangbang, please? Yeah, you know, you clean, so. You and know. yeah, show just your do that again. Bro. The worst that could happen, he'll punch you in the face. Ooh. <laughs> nah, and Wait. then he'll consider it, right? Wait, who gets punched in the face? I'm talking about him. I think oh, I get man. punched in the face and then he consider it. Yeah, Why not? Him. Nah, I'll run. All right, it'd be you gotta, you, gotta, you gotta come up to him with, with, with her IG already Ooh. pulled up. Like, yeah, wait, wait, <laughs> wait, wait, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Like, hey, bro, you like game bangs? <laughs> wait, 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 I, I'm not allowed to say because okay, well let me boy, find but, out. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Wait, she's not and, ugly, I'll tell you. Okay, that. and uh, that's they, wonderful. They, they do their whole thing, so I, I'm pretty sure he'd be interested. I'm pretty sure he would not second guess that shit at all. Pull up. Both of them so, will. <laughs> it helps their marriage. I don't know. For sure. It, I, that's it. Sound lit as fuck. You be having it swingers is. in the concert house. Yeah, of course. A lot of swingers do. Why would I, I kind of knew the answer to that. Mm-hmm. I had to ask just for, <laughs> yeah. just for the people. Yeah. Yeah. Like my dude right now isn't in a position to be able to like pull up to my content events and shoot with me just due to like work and stuff. But when he retires, that's definitely the plan. Like we out here throwing dick together. That's real. Um. <laughs> that's real. I respect that. That's not. It's definitely for the hoes, and I love it. For sure. He pays for his porn. Even my porn. I, mean, I would hope your, he would pay for yours. Yeah, like you know, I, don't, I feel like crazy. a lot of guys, like their girls, they want it for free. Like that's my girl. Like she's getting fucked. I'm letting you fuck these guys. Like I get yeah. to see it for free at least. Yeah, like, that should be lit. No, I had a girlfriend like, no, that did content. Like he support support me. Yeah, if I had a girlfriend that did content. I'd be I'd be supportive. Oh, shit, yeah, yeah, that's sick as fuck. You winning? I mean, yeah, for him. I'm not salute to your man. I'm not as uh, <clears> grown <throat> as him. If, if I I would date a girl with OnlyFans, but I don't know if I'm like grown enough to like let her like f- like fuck other dudes. You should try it. See what happens. I probably that's probably one of the things where, like crying. you don't know till you try. It. Yeah, yeah. You probably <laughs> be like, oh, well, this ain't that yeah. bad. I mean, he's just dicking her down. I mean, I do that. That was just was that something y'all had to like like get <laughs> no. out and open before? Oh, we were definitely knew. already open before. Okay, we met at a time where both of us were just have decided that we were going to be poly already. Okay. Um, and I was working as an EMT, so I wasn't exactly doing sex work then. Um, and then I transitioned back into sex work. Um, and since we already had the open poly dynamic and like were able to have other partners, it was a no brainer. Like there was no real conversation about it. Um, because of our dom sub dynamic though, that kind of affects my porn and the only way that I can't do anal right now. Is he like, the is he the dumb or you? Oh, the dumb? for sure, he's the dumb. He's the dumb. Oh and yeah. You're the sub? Oh. oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Wait. What? If I was given all that power, I would not know what to do with it. Wait. Why you can't do anal right now? That's his ass. Huh? It's his. Oh. oh okay. You say it's his. I don't see porn until he, until he decides otherwise. It's, yeah. I don't, it's his. Yeah. I don't see porn star said he was saving that yeah. part for the. Yeah. Roxy Reynolds said that. Yeah, Roxy Reynolds said that. Yeah, yeah she said it a lot. Yeah. That's, that's, I, that's, I was hoping it would be me, but it never worked out. Yep. People can only just, you know, dream about it or you can watch me fuck it with a toy, but like yeah. that's as close as you might get. That's not so, that's not asking a lot. It's not. Yeah, that's <laughs> really not. That's I really do anything not. else. That's like really... <laughs> other dudes can like piss on me and he's just like, me next. Like <laughs> it, ain't, it ain't nothing. Like, that's rude. <laughs> like I'm lucky as shit. All right. So should we pull out the car? Wanna... Yeah, go for oh, it. Oh, what do we have here? What are these? We're just gonna do like a couple of because we don't want to be here all night. It's this uh, a game. Y'all like me. 
Okay, we'll be here all night. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> oh I ain't got to work in the morning. <laughs> <laughs> Devin, you closer, so pull yeah. it up to the camera. All it's right, It's called now. Extra Dirty. Okay. Devin, show the top of the top of it to the to the camera. So Extra Dirty, all right. Salute to them. They sent us that for free. Oh, nice. Yeah. Truth so, or Drink, I think it was a lot drink. of truth. Can I get this on like Amazon or something? Yeah, yeah what yeah, the yeah. fuck? Okay. Bro, this, got a, this is a big-ass box. Should I... I think do, I, do you know the rules already? Did you have the rules? Well, like we did not. We're not going to do the rules. I feel like we're probably just going <laughs> to pull the Let's just pull them out and, just, let's and pull see them. what we got going on. Let's they all look kind of the same, This shit in a secret locket. Oh, there's a lot of fucking cars. This is a like, book. Yeah. Right. How many should I pull out? Just pull out like, just pull out one there here and there. Chef don't like spades. Like I'm playing spades. I don't know how to play spades and I'm too old to learn because everyone's just like, sit here, right here and watch. And then like, yeah. they just act like I don't exist anymore. I had the app on my phone. <laughs> Took my black car years ago about this shit. It's okay. I can play file. I can play gin rummy. <clears throat> so just pull out random ones. Random random ass, right? <laughs> Y'all ready? Yeah, yeah I'm let's ready. Get it. Okay. Come on now, read it. Out, 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 out of the room. Read out loud. Just read out loud. We just answer it. If it's a if how it's do you a, drink though? I got it. <laughs> we just we just take a sip and drink. Okay. Just, just ask them and then we just just, just read them out. We just ask all right, because this question is like, all right, whatever. And if, right. It, if it's a bad one, that's just like if it's get lame. Good. If it's lame, then, just like, don't, don't read it. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna if see. you feel like the answer is gonna be yes anyways, like don't even bother. Okay. The first question is, whose leaked celebrity news have you looked at? Were you just looking or you know? Oh, I was looking at Big Sean's dick for sure, like the, the <laughs> fucking Sean switch. Dick. Like, oh boy, that was like I'm not usually with the like leaked. News I forgot that nigga had his like, news leak. Yeah, because like you know, it lacks consent and mm-hmm. like yeah. I don't like that shit. But mm-hmm. I saw it. That's back when. That's back before the leak. At it. That's before that leak law now. Like the, uh, mm-hmm. the revenge the porn. Yeah, yeah, revenge porn shit. You could. Yeah, that's that. real as hell. I was like, I wish somebody, my lose must have not been that good because nobody leaked my shit yet. Well, I ain't made nobody that mad yet. That's the right? reason why I decided to do porn anyways and yeah. like record it because I was like, I was letting all these dudes like record me like fucking and I was just like, it's going to end up on the internet one day. Might yeah, as well do it. Might as well get, might as well get ahead of the game. <laughs> like, let me give you a name to at me at if mm. you're going to post it. Um. So, yeah. Big Sean. Big Sean. Mm. What yeah. about you, Amp? Uh, One of my favorite ones. Like, uh, it's thinking back, it's kind of, it is revenge porn because of shit leak. I remember when Rihanna shit leak. Mm. That was. And then she did it, Playboy? Yes. Her, it's crazy because she her news leaked and everybody was like going crazy like damn Rihanna naked. Yeah. Now she's just always, always naked. She's always she's naked. naked. She's naked Nobody every day. Most other women are like that though. They yeah. like you know they nah, always yeah. naked. I'm like, the shock okay, factor cool. is gone. Yeah, it should be a yeah. Thursday. She just have her titties out. You're like, All right. <laughs> this is fucking typical Thursday. I say the person who knew was I saw leak. I was kind of disappointed because oh, no. how they was presented to it. It wasn't even news. It was like a, a, a video. It was a sexy bride. No. I love her. No, I see that shit like every day. That's no, I expected. I expected that. From I expect. Her. I wanted it to be lit. But uh, Christian, Christian, um, Christian Rock, Christian Rock. When that that first video mm-hmm. uh, they made when she was uh, uh, riding that riding his dick, I was like, that's not impressive dick. Right now, right <laughs> she could have kept that. Like, that's not that don't that ain't I'm that's not that doing shit. nothing for me. Yeah, yeah. It didn't do it didn't do a damn thing for me. I'm like, I've I've had better. What's the point of recording? <laughs> I've that? seen yeah. better. <laughs> that yeah. Could have saved the energy on that. <clears throat> I'm surprised. Right. I'm surprised you didn't say Drake. I mean, <laughs> it was impressive, no but like he's not my type. Also, mm-hmm. if we were together, we'd def- domestic violence. Because he sure. light skinned Jamaican and um, British. I'm and a Scorpio. Toronto. And he and his fucking fillings, and I got <laughs> fillings too. And <laughs> we ain't finna talk about them. Either we're gonna fuck or we're gonna fight. So, so um, what's the what's the drink part? I don't understand. If I didn't answer it. Oh, oh we not playing. Yeah. So yeah, the, that's that's what it what probably so to been, the people though. that want to buy the game. The game is. You pull the cards out and everybody tell their story and whoever have the worst one got a drink. So mine would be the worst one. We got to vote like who's Rihanna. the worst one. But we not going we just answer <laughs> the questions, bro. So this one says if one of your sex organs were to fall off, which body part would pick up the slack? If my pussy fell off, my mouth would be just fine. Perfectly mm-hmm. fine. Mm-hmm. Just fine. Mm-hmm. I feel the same way if my dick fall off, my mouth would be. You say it's- your mouth ain't crazy, bro? Hey, yeah. yo. Okay. I'm doing it to women, <laughs> <laughs> not to men. If I'm doing it to men, then it'll be. <laughs> um, I say I got I got strong wrist, so I say my my uh really my finger game pr- pretty good, bro. Yeah, that's I, a good one. I, do you keep your hands manicured? Okay, they look pretty manicured. Yeah, I, I work. Okay. I, 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 I work. I do a, a dirty job for a okay. living, so like keeping my nails clean is like okay. a priority. So yeah, 
All right. Because that's yeah. one of my things. I <clears throat> actually, <laughs> in porn, I have a lot of, like, I don't have a lot of no-nos, like, on my list. And a lot, my number one no-no is don't finger me. Because niggas fanging nails. Anyone. Beef. Girls, too. Like, with our acrylics. Like, I just know. Yeah, just, I wouldn't want those in that. me. But even if it weren't, like, like <laughs> that. Even if it weren't, like, I know how to finger myself with these. That's um, crazy. They're, they're not sharp. And like it's really nah, soft. Nah, I've seen there. chicks with the sharp. Oh, I used to do that, that, but I'm not trying to torture myself no more. I care now. Damn, uh, I love love that. Myself. How <laughs> many sex toys have you owned in your life? Oh, well, she should go first. <laughs> so I used to do Amazon toy testing, and they would just send them to me for free, and I would get like ten at a time, like shipped to the house. <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> Um, it always tripped me out how they ship sex toys. It's shipping like big ass boxes, boxes and, and shit. Like, yeah, like, and it's like one little toy this. in it. But I was getting like ten at a time shipped to the house, like a week. Like three would show up on a Monday, four more would show up on fucking Thursday. Like Sunday, Amazon pulling up. Like it was ridiculous. You're but like, what you building, bro? So yeah, right I was <laughs> got these big ass boxes. Like yeah, so I would say around that time, I probably had well over fifty sex toys in all, all in all, like. Of all kinds, like dildos mm. and vibrators and like little fuck machines, big fuck machines, like rose toys. Like I had, I had it all, but yeah, that's where I, I most of my dildos came from mm. for sure. It was Amazon. Yep. <laughs> all right. Um, I never had like one just for me, but I've I was in a relationship and we used to get like toys here and there. So like maybe like three mm-hmm. in my lifetime. Three? Yeah. Like yeah. what? Like a rabbit and like a vibrator. Yeah, a rabbit, or... vibrator. Yeah. Uh huh. So, shit like that. Like a dildo and... Then you have a dildo. Just like maybe like vibrator type shit. Okay. Yeah, All right. That's good that. shit. That's good shit. For sure. What about you, Devin? 22? 22? Yeah. Are I, you a freak freak? Yeah. You uh, had, we was... Uh, there's like whips and shit kind of sex toys? Yeah. I done had chicks pull up with the... the the bondage shit? The, no, the chain. The uh, collar. Like a collar. The, the oh, dog okay. collar. You never had that shit where you wrap that shit in your hand? You... Nah. Really? I wouldn't, I wouldn't be oh. against it, but I never had it. Camera count as a sex toy? Shit. Such good shit. Huh? Does cameras count as a sex toy? Camera? It can. Yeah. I, would, can I, I would consider it as can a sex toy. It? Okay. A, yeah. Oh, you're talking about like a video camera? Yeah. Yeah. yeah just oh, okay. a tripod. Using it for sexual pleasure. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. Roses, when the Hitachi first dropped, mm-hmm. I had to get that. Um, mm-hmm. The Rose shit, I. Yeah. <laughs> So oh. that's kind of ironic when you said rose because I had got a gift for you because last time we talked on the podcast you said you never had a rose so I had uh, yeah. got you one but Lace I'm pretty sure you, had, you said you already had one but I had one that was like so I had a couple of different <coughs> ones um like so I had the one that's like uh, so oh my gosh yeah yes thank you yeah oh my gosh thank you and it's like a really good travel size too so I can just be blasted on myself and yeah, did you uh did you purchase that. Oh, uh, I think I got it last time because she said she never had yeah. one. Yeah, you know, I think it's already been open. Oh, oh you, you tried it out? Did you try it no, out? Make sure it's it's on the gooch, you tried it on the gooch to make sure it was okay? It wasn't tested. I, it I, was I, looked, not I opened the box and looked at it. Out. <laughs> Rose <laughs> on the gooch. Hmm. <laughs> you put it on the it gooch, had, bro. It, people, gooch? it has not Sorry. been used. I think I ain't got no receipt for it. Okay. <laughs> Stop lying to me, bro. I'm not going to return it. They don't, don't usually let you do that with these kind of items. <laughs> yeah, it, didn't, it didn't get me off. Can, I, can I bring this back? Because when, <laughs> when it was sent, you were thinking it had like the plastic around it. It yeah. didn't have no plastic. It was just sent like that. It was like, like this. And, like, yeah, and I that's opened right. it up and I was like, all right, that's a rose. Yeah, but it was sitting in a big ass box, like a lumber box or some shit. Like, discreet as my next like best eater so this is definitely going to be helpful <laughs> right now in that search like for sure <laughs> oh good uh I, you might not want to answer this one, <laughs> but if you I feel free to, to no, um it's so bad cumulatively how how many different fingers have you had in your asshole <laughs> you can answer <laughs> in oh, people huh. if you like 10 fingers per person um, I'm supposed to drink to that. Yeah, you're supposed to, I guess, if you're not going to answer that. Um, How many fingers? I ain't shit in my ass. I don't know. I really love, I really love, once, a, I really love a thumb in the booty, though. So no, no, like, no, I feel like a lot like, of people do that. It's about like at once. Oh, at all at in one a time? session, yeah. Maybe three. Three fingers in your butt? Yeah. Maybe three. That's not standard. 
No, not for me. I never had I, a thing my in my butt. My was tight. Somebody tried to put their finger in it the other day, and I was like, "Homie, chill out. It's not gonna work." <laughs> Every day they try, and uh, it's just not gonna work. <laughs> Gotta loop it up with the, with the yeah. shit. They make shit for that. Like, no, it was not it was not gonna work. Damn. I gotta unlock it myself before anybody else can attempt to get in there. So three is the limit. I, that apparently, maybe four so. in one day. If I had been stretching pretty regularly, like <clears throat> I can get it up to probably yeah. I've had three. He put three in there. Huh. Yep. And they had like gloves on. Oh, <laughs> Don't ask me that. I never had. You got a drink. I did already. He, his answer was zero. I'm gonna keep drinking. <laughs> I already took my sip. I ain't had no fingers in my ass. So. All right. Maybe when I'm 70, I don't give a fuck about that shit no more, bro. And it's like, hey, what's up? Blast my ass. I'm just well, throw it in there. Well, shit. And soon you gotta get your prostate checked. Ooh. Fuck. I'm five years away from that, ain't I? Yeah. Damn. You should record it. I'm not counting no. Should I, should I count that <laughs> one? It's a doctor visit. Should I count that one? I won't, I won't count. I count it. Fuck it. I count it. You make it a fetish. So right now both yeah. of us zero, but it's soon to be. I guess it's soon to be two. I think they yeah. put two up your ass. Now unless I gotta go back because they didn't get the right readings and some uh-huh. shit. <laughs> but I have mass spell like, all right, so uh, I have yeah, four false readings. Sorry, <laughs> false positive. Try this again. Hopefully by that time they had better devices. <laughs> they yeah. gotta yeah. put their fingers in my head. They were like, yeah, we, 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 we gonna keep it old school. <laughs> With a robot fucking malfunction in your ass. Yeah, I don't want a robot finger malfunctioning my ass. ass. Nah, Cause, boss, cause you can think about it. Yeah. You can think about why don't they just use like the girls had a little the toys or whatever the yeah. little fuck machines. Yeah, that's crazy to put a fuck machine up your ass. <laughs> but how can they can't come up with like some kind of like wand or something to put up your ass or something like that? I thought like they that. did. I thought they did. No, they still do fingers. The they still do fingers. So what's that thing they use with the camera? The colonoscopy. And the tube? Yeah. Why they don't just use that? Because I. Don't think I think they have to feel yeah, versus feel seeing. Yeah. Why? Just I'm not exactly Why? sure. I know a lot of things, but that's not one of them. What's the practice? Do they practice on animals first and then work on? No, they definitely the people? do people first. So people just come in and volunteer, be like, "Hey, they do your thing in my yeah. ass." Really. No, they like usually work at a hospital or like a clinic as a residency or like a fellowship. Um, so they get their hours in and they usually work under another doctor and the doctor is like, this patient needs you to finger their ass. This is going to be your patient. Yeah. All right. This is how we're going to do it. Put a glove on. Great. Now put some lube on your glove. Great. Now tell the patient to do this and ask the patient, is it okay that my student is going to be doing this? So I used to work in a GYN office. So they have actual like gynecology students like come in and actually like do pap smears and such on patients. So I've actually witnessed it for women. So I'm pretty sure it would be the same for, you know. Oh, it's just my time okay, to go. Yeah. It's just my time to go. I'm not going. Yeah. I'm not doing it. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck it. Yeah. So, I like this question. Um, <clears throat> have you ever been told you were doing something wrong in bed? Oh, yeah. All the time. Okay. Not all, <laughs> not all the time. But I'm, I'm but a, you you have partners who communicate. Yeah. I actually I actually yeah. prefer that. Because yeah. I'm not there to hurt you. I'm there to, for both of us. To yeah. I actually, I got a, uh, I think I got a pleasure kink. Like, I, I get off knowing they getting off. So, mm-hmm. yeah. I mean, I can know if you touch my ear, I don't give a fuck. But right, right. Getting them off is cool. So, like, if I'm doing something wrong, like, I want to know up front. Like, hey, yo, yo. Okay, okay. I do it like this instead. Okay, right. Bet. And it works yeah. out for the best. All you gotta do is just listen. Don't take no offense, yeah. no yeah. shit like that. That part. Definitely <laughs> like nothing nothing recently. Of course they give you like this, the regular tips. Mm-hmm. But definitely when I was like younger and when I first started having sex, like I wasn't giving head right. Mm. So I was giving one girl head and she was telling me like I was doing I was in the <laughs> wrong area. Uh, yeah, and she helps set the pieces. But yeah, yeah. She, at least she lets you know though, so you're not just over here, yeah, know, looking yeah. random holes. Yeah, because like, I didn't know coochie was so sensitive to. I started eating coochie, and I'm like, oh, it's super sensitive. So I got, like, I can't bite that so motherfucker. Rough. You don't have to like yeah. jam your face in it, like yeah. Just yeah. That's chill why I said, that's why a penis is completely different. Because I'd be like, man, give me them teeth, <laughs> give me that throat, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> mouth, give me, I said mouth, give me all of that <laughs> neck, <laughs> mouth and till neck, you, till you suffocate. <laughs> so for me i think um sometimes i get really like into it and like i say i've been told to slow down They're now like, when whoa, you say whoa, whoa, now when you down. say too into it what are you talking about like, oh i'm like i'm going i'm like throwing neck and like going in and they're like chill out like, and it's like slow down yeah they're like slow down or like chill out are like, these women no oh they're, like dudes oh. and they're like chill out like no it's not chill but also i feel like that's 
like I'm sorry. That's how that's how I wanted to fuck you. I didn't really take into consideration how you wanted to be fucked. <laughs> like that's sorry. Like I want to um, be. I want you to be the big spoon when we done. Like, stop, yeah. Like stop. yeah. So I'm like, what right, are you doing? Out, stop. Like, and, then, and usually in that case, I'm like, all right. Well, then you're gonna have to take control at this point because otherwise, I'm going to I'm going to slut you out. Beta man. This is when you was on the pill. Beta man. No, this is just <laughs> like, about to ask no, that. Just, just a typical just, Tuesday. <laughs> just a typical Tuesday. <laughs> Yeah, I've been, I've been trying to slut guys out, and they're apparently not for it. Like, some guys not comfortable with me. The pill. And that's that's okay. I don't always need the pill, but when I do, some guys not comfortable with me and slut it out. They like they they, they like they yeah like, they control. No, no, no. Slut me, slut me the fuck out. Yeah. <laughs> uh, growing up, what was the most incorrect thing you believed about sex? Mm. When I first uh, I think about that one. When I first found out what head was, I didn't know it looked like that. I didn't know. <laughs> when yeah. I first sucking dick, I didn't know it was, like how they. Oh, uh, okay, perfect. Okay, you remember no, that show? Why you think about it? know it fucked me up? What? So you know how when you was kid, you used to watch Cinemax and shit. Yeah, that's that's so, what I was getting into. Like a lot of the time, so Cinemax is like erotica. Yeah. So a lot of the time when the girls used to ride the dudes, they used to be like way up here. Yeah. So I used to think like. <laughs> I used to think like, do you ride the stomach? That's sex. Or when she was giving head, the head, the girl head would be way up there. I was like, I, I didn't understand it. When I when I saw my actual first live dick sucking, it wasn't no porn shit. It was uh like uh Atlanta. It showed this come on HBO called Atlantic City Hookers, hmm. and like this one dude picked up a prostitute and like she was doming him up in the top in the um car, and the way she was moving her head, I'm like, damn. So like that's what sucking. That's what they like when they suck dick. I'm in the sixth grade, bro. I didn't know. I thought they like just literally like just suck on like it. Like a lollipop. Like a lollipop. I didn't let their heads be going like that. I was like, dang. So she had, oh shit. That's that's how it looked. I didn't I, I had never knew. I was a jit. So yeah. that's one thing that like blew my mind. Like till I got older. I'm like, okay, yeah, she need to be her head need to be like. I think <laughs> I'm trying to think what mine would be, it's just because the fact that I mean, maybe it would just be like about the whole size thing, like the like size doesn't exactly matter so much. Uh-huh. Um, like girth is probably more important than length <laughs> and ability to keep it up and, like, and performance in performance as well. Like able to keep it up or like not multiple times. Cause like I'm a marathon fucker. Like you fuck me once. I'm like, all right, that was great. So like again, they can get no again. water first. I'll throw you in water again. <laughs> like, no, because I feel like I get hornier every round. And then eventually it's just kind of like, you got to fuck me till I die now. Oh, you got a hollow Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I'm like, you yeah. just got to fuck me to death or else you're going to be stuck in this like cycle of just, you know. So, yeah, I think that that's one thing for me. The whole like size thing is isn't as important as performance. Mm. Um, yeah, because there's those them G spot them G spot jabbers. All day, all uh, fucking day, all day. I, I want to pick it back off something you said about the uh, the the uh, soft core porn shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I used to thought when they was doing doggy style, I thought he was doing anal. So like that was mm. always oh that makes sense. The, I guess you the, could... the first time I did doggy style with a shit, it did not go so well. Oh boy, because I <laughs> made a mistake and ran it in a. And she didn't know neither. She thought that's what it was supposed and that's to be. That's what it is. I didn't know the pussy can reach back. <laughs> so I didn't understand pussies back then. So. so it's funny. So they don't eat like back when I was watching. So I watched a lot of porn when I was young. Unfor- like unfortunately, I was exposed pretty early nah, to that's porn. Cool. We guys, we um, did it. But like once I got my hands on it, it was definitely like watch porn every day after school. So my thing is, yeah, I never even had boat. the soft, like I never got to watch softcore porn before that. You so for me, it was like all like big booty beauties and like Asian persuasion and I like Lexington like it's, it's better you went that route And though. like, so for me, like all I, the, like I was surprised when I first had sex and like he ate my pussy. Cause well, was that wasn't like that. something that I really thought is like being a part of like sex. Cause it's not really in porn. It's not highlighted. It's not a big part of the scene. Like nah, you suck, they is. suck dick longer than like a guy would put his mouth on a fucking pussy. If anything, he'll spit on it. And then like, <laughs> that's it. <laughs> Especially back in that days, like back in those days too. Like it wasn't so much like pussy eating. You got to blame um, the rapper. Cause they told me not to eat pussy. Yeah, they said, so, don't do that. <laughs> eat that pussy. Yeah, yeah. So when I first, like somebody okay. put their mouth down there, I was like, it wasn't a uh, second. It was a little Wayne. Like, yeah, it was amazing. Now as I got Fuck older, I'm like, I, I love eating pussy. That's my favorite. Like, that's yeah, my shit. Yeah, I love eating pussy. pussy. You got to think about it. Like, for example, when me and Devin was in high school, if you ate coochie, you was getting you was getting roasted that whole day. 
frowned upon. Like, home. people was getting... Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah you, you get, get frowned upon yeah, for this shit. You can be no pussy. Like, <laughs> but you're supposed to get your dick sucked. <laughs> That's why. So when, the, when you had sex with the dude and he ate you, he ate you out. That was kind of like he was kind of wilding back then because like you really he was a white dude, wasn't he? No, I what? don't fuck white dudes. Niggas, it's niggas nothing, did like, not want to eat. There's nothing pussy. wrong with it, but it was like one of those <clears throat> things where like people it wasn't socially accepted back then. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's so crazy. That it, nah, I, I everything I a woman I'm realize, it's in my mouth. <laughs> I don't realize that that was a part of an issue because oh yeah, they used a to like thing. lie about. Fucking me and eating my pussy and shit. You never heard that? They used to f- lie on my coochie for days. You ever never heard that man <laughs> fresh line? Don't eat no pussy, cause I don't. I heard it, but I yeah. never met anybody who lived by it or even preach it. To be honest, growing up, I, I, that's a, that's <clears throat> wake up material. If I if I'm talking to you and if we fuck three times, you ain't fucking put your mouth in my pussy not one time. We're not compatible. But then seeing how them Louisiana niggas is and they what they believe in, I see why they don't eat pussy. Like that's oh, spaghetti yeah, yeah. shit. Some of the I see it. why they don't eat. But pussy. nowadays it's different. Like you gotta eat that shit the first link, damn there. Yeah, I mean not sh- even first. Like that's like like I said, you got three times. Like I understand. Yeah. Like you're she not gonna eat no ass. stranger coochie. I respect that. <laughs> like eating ass the first link is crazy. Is it? I mean. <laughs> I feel like at that if point, it's clean, like, I mean, I'm a shit. You know what I'm saying? Like you trying to some people that's just a don't. Real slut, I like that. My biggest thing is some people don't know how to foreplay, and that's that's that and the there's issue. that too. Yeah, they don't know how to get the juices flowing. I don't like that. Yep, right, I agree is. with that. One it, it is my girl. Yeah. It is now. No, I'm just kidding. Uh, which world leader do you think gives the best oral sex? Oh, what? That's what. Hey, that's that's what they say. I ain't answering that because like, worth of the world leaders is men. <laughs> nah, we got a female vice president. Oh, I don't think she'd be I don't giving that like sloppy be, though. I don't feel like she'd be throwing that. Yeah, off that. If she, if she, I feel like she'd be throwing ass, man. I feel like she'd be throwing ass and like having a good time riding dick, maybe. If she, if she throw but like, a, I don't think she throw neck. If she throw an ass back like how she run the country, we in trouble. Well, because I, I ain't like, heard this woman do shit. No, <laughs> no she used to date. She used to date Montel like back in the day. For America. Montel like Jordan or Montel Williams? Williams, the the, <laughs> the sailor. <laughs> Montel Williams from the TV show, the, the, the TV show. Yeah, he's the same. Like, hey. <laughs> that's so random. It's only two Montel. It is only two Montel. I had to ask like Jordan. No, you talking about Williams? Williams, Williams, the TV show dude, the bald dude. Yeah. Okay, so he's had a psychic on his shit. All right, okay. so I'm, I'm gonna skip that. I'm, fu- I, I, I'm gonna answer. I'm fucking Kamala Harris. I don't care what y'all say. I mean, she Kamala Harris. She was like, like yes. decent back in the day. She, she look okay now. She I look, don't think she looks too bad now at all. No, she pretty she in the face for sure. Nah, I feel like I get bored with her too quick. I don't Who know. said you got to marry her? No, no. I mean, like in general, I get bored with. Oh her too yeah, quick. yeah. I think like the whole thrill would just be like, I fucked a world leader, and like, yeah, be yeah. on that type of shit. I don't know. For me, I think. Oh, I still this is a good definitely. One. This is a better one. Oh boy, I don't know. That's rough. Gotta be like a president. I don't. Or something. God, my thing is, I know how white men give head. Topping up. Getting top from Vladimir Putin is crazy. Oh, I'm scared he might bite it. <laughs> He'll eat that he shit. He might legit He'll eat that shit. He'll try to warm that shit up. Like, but that nigga from real. Russia, bro. I am not with it. Um, I put pancake mix on his pussy. Would eat it the best. I'm trying to fuck you with a donkey. Yeah, I'm with that. Yeah, oh, I like a lot of freaky shit, but that is not one. Um, I, I would hope Obama was good. I used to definitely have like a little thing for him. He'll talk you through your nut. Yeah. Yeah. He says like inspirational shit mm-hmm. while you fucking. Yeah. Like, and like, saying, yes, we came. <laughs> yes, yes, we came. We came. <laughs> yes, we came. Now I know you've been holding that pussy and coming. I- <laughs> <laughs> but give it here. <laughs> Bend it over. Let me put my finger in it. I'll sit back. You you throw it back. You're going to throw it back for me. You throw it not throwing it back for me. You throw it back for America. Like, <laughs> like, what the fuck? Throw it back for America. Yes, <laughs> oh my gosh! I need it. I need it. <laughs> Throw it back for America. Yeah, I'll let you get this one. All right, let's see. Um. Oh, have you ever hooked up with a friend and then truly gone back to just being friends? If so, how? Yes. Um, I have, but it doesn't last. No, it don't. It can't. Um, it can't. You're no. not seeing each other naked and play with each other's genitals. It's kind of uh, yeah. It's not. <laughs> Um, especially like my, but right now, like in my lifestyle, that's kind of a fun thing that I can have these connections with people and like they are a partner and they also are friends. And it's like, 
you know, I, I link up with them and like See, that's the we have like a energy. connection, like actual relationship. But like it's never, I don't know, it's never like just friends. So I don't feel like that's an issue I have anymore. It's the adult thing to do. Yeah, like I. But I you, know. but everybody ain't gonna be. But I don't. Yeah, same I don't type usually hook up with somebody and they're back to just being friends. Especially because if I've hooked up with you and I just want to be your friend, it's because your dick was trash. Yeah, exactly. See, don't fuck them good. Then that's what makes shit awkward. When you fuck somebody, when you fuck a friend good, that's what makes shit awkward. Yeah. If you give them bad sex, then it's, it's whatever. Cool, yeah, whatever. Yeah, but then we they have don't five. understand that that's the reason why I yeah. don't want to be friends. And then that makes it hard to be friends. Because then once I tell you that your dick is trash, I don't feel like we're friends anymore. I personally take that. I um, take that. Like, as long as you think it's trash, that's good. We yeah. ain't got to. That might I don't be better wanna... for y'all that, that, yeah, that it's trash. Yeah, you yeah. like, all right. Yeah, we I had know. sex. And that's cool. It didn't. It wasn't good. Can Do we you, go play Madden again? You gonna feel yeah, like, for real. Can we get on GTA? Where it might hurt is when, like, she actually get a man. And you're like, damn. He fuck better than yeah. me. Yeah. Nah, you know what? I've actually had the reverse <laughs> happen to me. Um, the female friends that I have fucked, they told their dudes that we fucked. I'm like, why did you tell them that? What, yeah, why did you do that? That's perfectly that. fine That's with crazy. this nigga never knowing that we fucked. Because it's not relevant anymore unless what? he, he probably, asked you specifically. He probably, he, and he, probably, he never did. Okay. They told them. Oh, it, it happened twice. Voluntarily? Uh, voluntarily. It told, that's twice. Messy. it told him twice. I don't like it. I'll tell you about it after the bite. She was trying to. Oh, one of the two. I, 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 yeah, one of the two. She I'll was tell doing you. that to spite him. She was why, doing why, why spite him, though? Why put my name in it? I have nothing I to do know. with this. That's, I'm why, all right that's with why, that. why I put your name in it because you have nothing to do with it. Because what do you yeah. have to lose then? Yeah, yeah. Nothing. That's dangerous, that's some, though. Yeah, that's no messy shit. Because the dude could be like, man, I'm about to kill that nigga. Yeah, exactly. Once she told a dude at a party we was at, and I didn't even know the bro knew. Like, he done dap me up at the end of the night. And you feeling dumb because you're like, oh, my God. Like, I yeah. don't even know. Yeah, that they knew. I don't or, play Uno with this man. Next day, you know. <laughs> you know Uno be ruining families, I used to too. beat her back in. Like, you oh, been, my gosh. She used to fold her up. Like, bro, you, I, we could have went our whole lives without this nigga never yeah. knowing. Like, she was like, you never told none of your friends? No. No, no. Crazy. For what? I, still, I do fuck my friends. And I don't. And that's why I was like, I don't feel like that this is an easy question for me to answer. Because I'm like, I, I fuck them. And they're still my friends. I'm like, I fuck my friends. And I fuck their husbands. And we fuck each other and like it's a fucking great time so i can't i can't like, i can't i can't, I can't, I can't fuck friends no more because I, I i know how i am and i know how it ends up being and i, I can't fuck, I, I can't do it fuck the right friends though and that's the thing i definitely have found my tribe of people where i can yeah you know we can fuck each other's men's and <laughs> You know, see, and, and we also fuck each other too. We get really, you know, see that. See, get they, a little lonely, like uh, come cuddle. And like, I don't know all right, if they well, go that hard. It's been a while. Can I eat your coochie? Yeah. You know. I never. That's why I took my sip. <laughs> I got passed. Wait. You never gone back to just being friends? Oh, I was going to say like that one story you told when a friend came over with the dress on at one time. But I don't think you, you didn't do oh, that. that's not your friend? We I, was friends. We was, was all that, friends. Was that my friend? She was. I just had a crush on her. She was our friend. You know what's crazy? We on a yeah, we on a yeah. And she got her own podcast now. I I linked up with her recently. No, you didn't tell me yeah, that. Please tell me now. This on the yeah. Patreon. I'm not sure what part of this. I'm like, um, what's Ghost? Ghost on power when he got Angela. Now when you say linked up. <laughs> now when you say linked up. Oh no, no, I just no, nah, we ain't smashing nothing. Oh yet. damn. Yeah. <laughs> We ain't smashing that. I hope yeah. it's in the air. I hope yeah, it's in the air too. Yeah, y'all pray for me. Cause like, nigga, that's I, uh, that's like what ten? How many years we've been out of high school? A bit more than that. <laughs> like fifteen. That's what I'm saying. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to be like Ghost and Angela. What you just said? I'm trying to get my bitch back. Whoa. And it's crazy because her friend, <laughs> I smashed her, and now we can't be friends no more. That's what oh I'm yeah, yeah yeah yeah. Well, she yeah. got a dude now. Even better. Yeah. <laughs> Even better. Now, let's stop right there because people don't know what we're talking about eventually. So, yeah. <laughs> I who think she's still listening to the show. Who read in the card next? Uh, you. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah. So I drunk for no reason. I mean, no, no. She read the last one and you reason. answered the don't question. Don't say that. Yeah, yeah, don't yeah. be like that. There's always a reason to drink. <laughs> this one. He to quit. That's so funny. He quit drinking. Oh, uh, I'm not quit. I ain't gotta drive. Ew. Exactly. Me too. I'm usually yeah. <sighs> Yeah, okay, see, some of them questions be having me with that same. Yeah, some of these, yeah, some some of these kind of corny. You can pick another one if you want, I mean, since we're not really playing by the rules. I don't. I, I, know rules I, I think we're doing the rules right. Yeah. I know Fuck we're reading the, the cards. I think that's the only rule. Shit. Yeah, I can't even read. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I guess it's like a toxic question. Oh, okay. so let's go. Tell us about a time when you liked someone so much that you were driven to do something pathetic. Hmm. Pass. <sighs> <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Um, 
I would say so. I was a married. I was married for about eleven years. God Re- damn! You recently just divorced. Thing. Recently <laughs> divorced. Um, as of like last year. Last like year? officially, yeah, officially divorced as of oh. last year. Um, but I would definitely say trying to like, especially at the beginning, um, of the marriage, like trying to make things work, even though I should have been trying to make things work. Um, I was pretty fucking pathetic. Like I lied and told him that I was medevac to the hospital uh, via helicopter. And then he called me like a bunch of times because he was worried. And then I didn't pick up. Um, And then he was in the army. So he like called command and stuff (sighs) like to like, like extend his like um, (laughs) to extend his uh, leave um, to come find me in the hospital. And um, I wasn't there. And I just wanted a little attention. You want wait? That's you it. wanted attention? It's not like yeah. you didn't want attention. I did. I just wanted attention because he didn't call me back and like he wouldn't come see me. He was fucking other bitches and like I was in <sighs> denial. Um, yeah, he like yeah. So I was being real pathetic and like my friend went along with it and like at one point we actually drove to Orlando because we we're like where's the next trauma center? We're like shit, Orlando. We gotta get no. there. How fast is the helicopter? Like <laughs> oh shit, we gotta get there in less than an hour. So like, <laughs> wait, was this the beginning of the marriage or the oh, end yeah, of the yeah, marriage? It's the beginning. Uh, so what happened in between? Because you said eleven oh. years. What was oh, going baby, on? You have to wait for the for the book to come out. Oh my god! You have to wait I, for the I, book. I cop. You read the book? Crazy. Oh, so. I'm going to. I have to. There's uh, no reason. Right, to when, hell. You, when the book come out, we need a round three. I will do an audio yeah, book, definitely. and we can do like weekly audio book sessions where we fucking listen to a piece of it, and we can discuss that shit. Because I'm telling oh, you, yeah. it's a fucking ride. Um, <laughs> yeah. My life is a ride, but definitely that relationship itself took me to the pits of p- being pathetic. Um, being very pathetic and doing. He must have had waves. No, he's bald. Oh, damn. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah. Well, you know what they say. No, it's like they good, say good bald. Pussy, like, they say bald niggas with beards are <laughs> overly horny. <sighs> that tongue. Was damn, just... you hear that, Aaron? If you're on the picture, <laughs> you hear that shit. Man? That's crazy. And that's exactly what it had me. Overly horny is overly it's horny no... with the beard and bald and yeah, like yeah, crazy yeah. mouth game that like kept me there way longer than I should have. Oh, so you like... so you set up Tubi movies to make this marriage stronger than it was. What made you get out after all that? What made it was you bad? It was not good. Oh, okay. It wasn't good. The head was <laughs> <laughs> that. So the sex was bad, but the head. Was I don't good. know. The sex was good too. Oh, I mean, yeah. I I didn't have a lot of complaints there. And you got away. I did. I sure did. <laughs> Surviving a uh, military. I fucking, there were some things. There's some things I had to get away from. Um, this was not for me anymore. I outgrew. God, and damn. now I am loved as the slut that I am, and I want to be, and that I aspire to be. And he's like, "Sure. What do we got to do to make this happen?" <laughs> and I'm like, "Bet." And I'm like, "I'm gonna go fuck my friend's friend." And he's like, "Cool. Make sure you make it like record it on video so I can watch it." Like, sound like the guy you got now. That is the guy I got now. That's what I'm saying. Like, that's oh wait, no, my guy I have now is that. And like, my ex husband was not about that shit at all. Oh. He was like, "You should just be a cam girl and like fuck yourself on camera." And I was like, "That's weak." Um, what about dicks though? And he was not with it. So. <laughs> <laughs> that didn't work out. All right, we're going to do one more round because I want to talk about the website before we leave. Oh, right. uh, I saw I had a uh, new subscriber. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, these good. questions are... Make it good. Make I'm it real trying. good. <laughs> yeah, make it good since it's the last one. Yeah, make it or count. Or you got to pull that one out the box then. <laughs> <laughs> no, that was too crazy. <laughs> Okay. <clears throat> all right. Just, I think all of us can answer this question. Okay. If your genitals were a Muppet, which <laughs> Muppet would they be? <laughs> Definitely Miss Piggy, that greedy bitch. That's that greedy bitch. And she crazy for her Kermie. That's for sure. She mm. love her, her Kermit. Um, but she greedy bitch. Mm. Mm-hmm. That sounds like Miss Piggy to me. Uh, yeah, for <laughs> sure. Oh, no. I, know, I know sometimes you'd be like, Kermit. <laughs> oh. I'm gonna go with Gonzo. Gonzo, oh, God damn, that was mine. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck you. That was gonna be mine. You should have answered it. That's what you did. God damn. God damn. Why? 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 I don't know. I just always fought with Gonzo. He got a big nose. Gonzo, he got a big nose. He knows like... you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Why would it, why would it have been Gonzo for you? Uh, well, not no more. Uh, but I'm I go with Walker. 
Fuzzy. Okay. What's his name? Was Waka? Waka. Oh, Did you uh, say Waka Waka? Yeah, he did. Fuzzy, though. Yeah, Fonzie. 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 Fonzie, though. Yeah. Waka Waka Waka. Because if I like you, you know how they always say, like, you, <laughs> when your dick grow, it always depends on, like, the woman. <laughs> and um, I feel like I'm that with certain females. Okay. All right. Yeah, because he Muppet. was always happy and energetic. Muppet genitals. And that's how I am. Yeah. <laughs> like, when you get some, you get some new pussy. Yeah. yeah. All right. Okay. Yeah. I like it. It was a good one. He was always that down question, for whatever. Though. Yeah, that's a, who thinking of these questions? Who came like, up with that? A Muppet? Uh, e- extra dirty. Cut. All right. All right, now extra dirty. Take some of these cars. Truth or drink, extra dirty. Take some of these cars home with me, bro. Take that's that's right. Right. Yeah, 19 that's a good time. cars. There's a lot of them. I, I feel like I'd have a good time playing that at like a content event. Yeah. And then also, like some of my vanilla friends, they, sorry, <clears throat> I know they hate that word, mm. vanilla. But, um,. Oh, you got pick. Had to pick. One. Well, from these cards, you can play a whole well, just, goddamn yeah, a whole weekend. Time. But yeah, they would have a. a I'm gonna pick one for the box when it's my turn. Right. Um, but yeah, I have friends who like they would be shocked by some of these questions, which is, to me is hilarious. That's so crazy. It's so funny. This, the uh, content people. No, they, like my vanilla friends, like my real life, like friends who aren't in the industry. Really? Um, yeah, they would probably be very much so mortified and tickled by a lot of these. Questions. I would say like ninety nine percent of these questions. Because <laughs> they don't talk about their sex life. Like that's what? just not something they talk about. That's so boring. And then when they do, we have other things to talk about. Like it's true. It's true. It's we true, have other true. mutual interests. Like sex is literally a lot of my life. Like <laughs> it's nice to hang out with my friends, and that's not something I have to talk about that's true um you know yeah we don't we talk about other things i don't think we talk about sex till just now to my us (laughs) yeah i don't think we talk about it often like that yeah we don't talk about it we talk about other shit yeah yeah i don't really talk about it unless i'm like even with my partner unless i'm like asking for something i'm like hey yo you don't have to pull up with the bat and beat my ass i can expect that it wouldn't be a lot of sex talk at the content houses a lot of times, yeah. Or sometimes it's like not until we get into the room, we're like getting ready to shoot, and you're like, okay, like what yeah, don't we, you, what don't you like? Um, and then like you go off of that. But, yeah, because we all here, we already know what we do. We already know what we're here to do. Yeah, and like what don't you do and anything like that. Yeah, what you like to eat for dinner? Like, <laughs> yeah. what, you, what you allergic to? You're right. <laughs> oh, I like this one. All right, what's the shadiest thing you spent money on? Damn. Far as shady. Whatever you would consider shady, or maybe other no, not you, other oh. people. Well, other people would consider shady. Oh no, nah, definitely me. Um, I remember I was talking to this one chick recently. She hit me up on some. Um, I need you to buy me one of these. Uh, what is it called? Tim Skims dresses. Uh huh. Mm. Like Kim Kardashian's like Skims dress. Yeah. Okay. Like one of those. She was like, "Yeah, buy me one of those." Yada yada. And I'm like, I ain't talked to you in like two months." And you just this this was the first thing she texted me. Like, I want. You, I know you got money. I want you to uh, buy me some Skims. I'm like. I ain't no goddamn skins, but I, in my mind, that's what I was said. Was she gonna I, suck some dick? Another thing, she was not. Uh, oh, she was like, she wanted, she wanted, she was, said she was gonna watch me get, I mean, I was gonna watch her get dressed, and I'm like, I don't wanna do that shit. So, what I did was, I like, well, show me, show me, show me, um, show me what they look like. And so she sent me a picture of them. So I was like, oh, okay. So pre Valentine's Day, I bought another chick. <laughs> Some skins that I knew who was fucking. Right. And in turn, I saw her take those off. And yeah, that's what yeah. I was about to say. That, Great Valentine's that, that makes it worth it. But yeah. that's not even shady. Yeah. Like, I mean, she 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 gave me the idea. So I guess it wouldn't yeah. be shady. I guess you feel like it's shady because you stole the gift idea and gave it to somebody yeah, else. Yeah, I blocked like, old Bitch, girl. I don't want that. I don't want to buy that for I, you. But if there's somebody I will, yeah. that's a great idea. Let me get that. Yeah, yeah I blocked old girl. Okay. She, okay. she definitely shot yeah, that's her. That's weird behavior. Like, she was just trying to get your money. Mm-hmm. Pretty much. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So I know you can afford it. I'm like, I can't afford it, but I don't Doesn't mean I want to I know I'm not going to fuck you, it. though. I know. I have a feeling I'm not going to mm. fuck you. With your track record, I'm not going to fuck you. <laughs> so. All I right. What about you? I might have to take a sip because I can't really think of nothing. I'm not a petty person. You're a wholesome person. guy. I'm not a petty person like that. I am. So, sadly. Shady. You bought anything, like, that you wouldn't tell other people that you would want, it, like, covered up? It was once I was in a relationship. She really wanted to go to, I think it was somewhere in Texas. And then, like, oh, she wanted to go with me to WrestleMania. Mm-hmm. And then I broke up with her, and then I went to WrestleMania. <laughs> yeah, like a but I was going to go anyway. Did you take so. somebody else? She wouldn't enjoy it. She, she <laughs> only liked wrestling because I like wrestling. Okay. So she was like, oh, we going. And she was planning out a trip to WrestleMania. Like, oh, we about to, it was like in Dallas or some shit. Mm-hmm. Like, we're going to go there. We're going to have fun. And then, like, we, like, broke up. And then, like, nah, like, I bought me tickets and I posted it. Bought, got me some good ass seats. 
And I posted it up on Facebook and she seen it and then she blocked me. Ah! Yeah, nigga, you should have <laughs> What'd she you expect the fuck? Should have yeah. took me, nigga. I wouldn't I'm going to WrestleMania. <laughs> fuck her. I wanna <laughs> fucking win. You don't watch wrestling. Don't give a damn. I literally go to WrestleMania. It's WrestleMania. Like, I go every year though. <laughs> I don't watch wrestling anymore, but I'm starting to watch it again. I uh, watch for Wrestle fucking Mania, nigga. Oh. Uh, so let's say the shadiest thing I spent money on. I used to I used to trick off on dudes just because I could. Like especially when I first like That's was rare. eighteen. Y'all when hear I was, that? She's when I was rare. eighteen and I was like first started dancing and my husband had pissed me off and was like accusing me of cheating. I was like, fine, I'll go fuck other people. I'll also go fucking trick. And um so I was like spending money on like my guy friends and like taking them out to like mall at millennia. Like they're they're the in college, fuck is like that? freshmen in Orlando in Orlando, Mall at Millennia. Like on Conroy, like way, like it's like one of the malls with all the like that's the luxury big ass, stores, that's a big ass store. yeah, like with the Gucci stores and all that shit, yeah. and like oh, I fucking like take my guy friends and we just go fucking b- let them fucking ball out and just like I wasn't even really fucking them either, like one of them I was, um, <laughs> yeah, shout out, you know who you are, um, but yeah, I um, wasn't even fucking half of them. I was what just year like was having a good time. 2011 slash 12. We should have been friends. Fresh out of high school. I definitely <laughs> pulled up on that. We should definitely I was in Daytona friends. Beach. Yeah. <laughs> dancing at Diamond Dolls. <laughs> dancing at Diamond Dolls. Going to Daytona State. Daytona. Tricking on guys. They got a Daytona State. Yeah. That's, I, like God, the community, that's the community that. college there. I didn't know that. I live yeah, Florida for Cook, my whole life. Up the street life, from Cookman. That. It's right there when you come up International Speedway. Really? Yeah, yeah. What's their mascot? I don't fucking know. You went there? I, I cheered there too. I don't fucking know. <laughs> <laughs> she was a homeless man in a hat. Like, it could have been. been the Daytona Beach bums, and I would not have fucking thought a oh, thing about it. I was busy doing the whole shit. That's how I live. I wish I had a few bad friends. Like that. Oh like, man, you know, shopping shit. Pull up. Let's go. Yes, that was a good time. A good time in my life. Go definitely, right definitely sp- was spending my money reckless. I look back now and I'm like, <laughs> I don't have any of those things I spent all that money on. Like, you still got any of those crazy friends? young strepper. Oh my god, yes. Oh, yes. Oh my god, one of the girls on my cheerleading team, I had kind of adopted her. Her parents kicked her out because she like wouldn't make it home by curfew. And I was like, whatever the fuck, come to my house. Like, I have an apartment. Um, so she came to my apartment. I never let her go home. Um, we just got really drunk all the time and like had these all crazy ass fucking adventures and like wild times. Um. Yeah, and we still are friends, like, to this day. I, we need to catch up, really. Um, but, yeah, she's somebody I, I'm still friends with. And even, like, the guys that I um, were tricking off with, they're still my friends. I just don't get to like, I would still be your freaking well, friend, Well, my too. thing is, like, they, they, all got girls, they all got girlfriends or, like, yeah. wives and, like, raising their kids and stuff. And I know how that can feel as a woman who's definitely don't fuck with that shit. Like, I don't want to be intrusive, but I, I'm definitely open to, like, you know, chit-chat if they reach out to me or whatever. But I don't... I found that I'm just better off like you can reach out when it's good. Like I'm not trying to make something look like it's you know it's nah, not. That's that's respectful. I feel like, like yeah. I mean it's not an issue that I have, but I realize that it's a very common issue. Mm, so mm. I'll try and uh. Yeah, women don't like other women that. buying a man stuff for some reason. <laughs> No, so, but it was a good so time. Weird. That was probably the dumbest shit I spent my money on. <laughs> <laughs> nah, you make lifelong friends. Oh, already. man. No, they're already good friends. Like, even, like, looking out for my kid type shit. Like, really good friends in the long run. So, yeah. Just build a bond off tricking. <sighs> it's possible. Man, <laughs> tricking if you got it. Yeah. All right, so mine is, what's the strangest porn video you watch no. that still did the trick? <sighs> it still made me net? Yeah, it still did the trick. So many, bro. Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm a, I was like, uh oh. You know, I, I watch got, porn while I'm driving. Yeah, oh. I got one. I remember one time it was. So you know how they be doing like the parody porn? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. So that's it was, shit. It was a Pokemon one. It was called Strokemon. I haven't the, watched that one. <laughs> okay. And now it was a dude. Okay. A dude. He had on a <laughs> Pikachu outfit, and it was just. <laughs> A little yellow, there's a dude in a yellow Pikachu outfit, uh-huh. and he had his dick painted yellow. Oh no, and he was fucking the chick, it was like Misty. Okay, it was a girl I can dressed as this. Misty, and I was like, It's doing yeah, it for me. He still and let then, loose, yeah, did the thing. <laughs> <laughs> and I might be a freaky nigga, but I was like, All right, this got a fire. <laughs> That's good. That bill called it was called Strokey Mod. I'm gonna look that up. This just ruined my fucking child. I'm gonna fucking I'm gonna finger blast myself to that shit tonight. Uh, That's wild. I'm gonna go watch it, dude. I actually don't recommend it. it. <clears throat> Interesting. I wonder who started in that. Um. So, what what is it? The strangest was like strangest, the strangest. Yeah. 
it's fucked up because I'm like, this isn't strange. Everybody wants to like fuck monsters and demons. Um, yeah, they, but I like love that shit. <clears throat> like the like the monster porn, like Hinta. where it's like, so I want like the three D like demons like breeding fucking like all mm. that fucking shit like the nutting all in her and her stomach fucking like expanding type shit like forced impregnation like definitely <laughs> like I'm I fucking my mind goes to all the worst places I'll be and I love it. Like, mm. right, it's what hints I, I love it. I like I oh, fuck that's my shit. Yeah like a chick be getting fucked by like eight tentacles. I was like what the fuck is this? That's hey man you finished watching it. That's, that's what, what, it, that's what it I started honestly I first started with like my interest in that area was like tentacle porn. Like I was just kind of like they got live like, action that, tentacle that porn now. Yeah. No, that's how I do it. So uh, oh I know this. <clears throat> Um, and I'll admit why. Um, <laughs> but no, that's where I started. It was like definitely like the tentacle hentai, like back when I was like giving the family computer viruses and stuff. Like, bingo. Tentacles was doing it for me. It eighth grade. And me. then now it's like there's like monsters and like they make it 3D and like really realistic looking and like uh, big, huge fucking like, you know, ogre monsters and like gigantic dicks and <laughs> fucking them coming out of her fucking mouth. Uh, I'm just like, you're like about like out of her fucking mouth type <clears throat> shit. Like, Goblin, Goblin Slayer. You should watch yes, that. Yes, that kind of shit. Like, oh, yeah. that's the kind of like stuff. Also, oh, there's, I mean, yeah, I, I watch it whole. There's kind of not a lot of stuff I don't watch. <laughs> like, if I see either monsters or like two black people going at it, I'm going to watch for a second to decide if I'm into it or not. And I probably don't know I'm into it until I've already came. And I'm like, whoa, that was, that was cool. Yeah, that's when I first discovered a uh, post net clarity because I like watch shit. shit. I watch I watch shit like that. Like, what the fuck am I doing? <laughs> gotta have ancestors watch me watch this shit. Yeah. Ah, yeah. I gotta delete this shit on my computer. Yeah, fuck, I probably got a fucking virus. Yeah, disgusted with myself, but it got it did the trick yeah. for sure. <laughs> Oh, you got a job, though. That's how I know watching hentai because it's shit, crazy shit, like how she described. Yeah, I wish I could create it. Like, like that would be the coolest. It, it is possible. Uh, it like I said, they start doing a live action shit. It now. takes a lot of resources, but it's definitely something that would be so fucking cool. Yeah, they'd be nothing like, everywhere on them shit. Yeah, <laughs> like you have to really know how to act too because like you're not really feeling anything. It's all like you know the special effects and stuff. So that'd be, that would be really cool. Um, yeah. I watch a lot of stuff, like kidnapping, porn, like all kinds of stuff. Like I'm going into, I'm porn, into all of it. Going down the porn rabbit hole. I yeah, like it's that. bad. Yeah. Like I definitely sometimes when I realize I'm like this isn't doing it, I'm like, well, I know it will. Yep. And I'm like, oh hey, god, you know, here you know, I am. You know how you have the YouTube conspiracy rabbit hole? People go down. It's a porn rabbit hole. <laughs> you go down to you be like, hmm, <laughs> wonder what this about? Why is he? Do they make porn about shit? this? Uh-huh. Oh shit! They do. Shit. Oh fuck! Well yeah. now they got they got uh, up north. Uh, when you go to like certain sites, now they got that uh, one lady sitting down talk about like uh, AIDS verification type shit. She's like a senator. I can pull it up right now. Yeah. After certain time times, mm-hmm. like you can't just go like if you in Philly. I learned mm-hmm. that when I was up there. You can't just go to Pornhub like you can down Virginia, here at certain times. Right now, yeah, so Virginia when I'm at, too. Yeah. yeah, when I'm home and my grandparents like visiting and stuff, I can't like get on Pornhub and just like search for things yeah. unless I sign in and I can sign yep. in because I have a model account and they have my ID on file already for me like being a verified model on Pornhub but yeah everyone else like they can't find my shit oh I'd be like nah I'm going to another site yeah I'd be going <laughs> that's to like 20 I other usually, sites I'm usually in Maryland to. though so I was like but, that's yeah. not usually an issue but so like so it's a porn bag because I'm going to Philly next yeah, month it's a porn bag if you go out there and watch, try to watch Pornhub at a certain type of time if it's you, a if time it's not, thing there yeah if it's not already saved to your phone even sometimes when it's saved to your phone it still gets through but it's like it's this lady this Go, the governor of of uh, Pennsylvania. Yeah. yeah, she be sitting on the bed talking about yeah. So now we have this certain porn verification. Oh like, yeah, there's a yeah there's a porn star. It's a whole like, mess. Write a letter to your senators yeah. because of there's a you know censorship and blase squase. Yeah, but, you know what I mean. But can you, it's can it's you like that like because. OnlyFans? Oh, you um, still go on OnlyFans. Yeah, you still go on OnlyFans, yeah. which yeah. is just weird. Like, it's like main popular sites like Porn Pornhub Hub, and um, I think X, X videos, videos, maybe. I'm not uh, sure. A few of them. I just still watch my own porn at that point. I'm like, all right, well, yeah, I yeah. know it's not blocked. And it's because, you know, some some stuff was getting uploaded to Pornhub that wasn't adult porn. And that's yeah. why they or started doing that shit. Either. Yeah, or consensual. And that's why they started yeah. doing that shit. And a revenge porn and... Yeah. But I type in shit like Buddha talk. I'm like, I know most of this shit was consensual, right? Yeah. Right? Yeah, Especially <laughs> studio stuff. They signed consent forms. Yeah. Even if they didn't read the dumb shit. Oh, fucking dumb bitch. But that shit, get shit. On my, that shit get up on earth. I be sitting with my whole dick in my hand and this lady pop up. I'm like, ah. Oh. Nah. 
Fucking boner killer. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now I gotta find a scene some goddamn Miss Boner Killer lady. Every fucking time I yeah, do this, she you got do on, this. She got on a um uh, a suit. Uh, 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 what is it called? Women, females. Like I don't see that. I don't know that man. Like fuck a, it. I put my phone away. Like, yeah, and I thought I thought she was gonna be doing porn in the video because you could press play and she started talking. I'm like, okay, maybe uh, she about to. Yeah, maybe yeah. she about to do some shit. Started and right. she, she this something new. <laughs> yeah, it's something new. It's, it just started <laughs> this year. Yeah, like, mm-hmm. actually, yeah. Yep. Because <clears throat> I'm like, I'm pretty sure I had a lot of porn hub shit saved on my phone, and I never had seen this bitch before. But now, yeah, that's what you got to do. Age verification shit. All right, so we're on Gianna website. What's it? OM Gianna? Yeah, you can click that link right there. Oh, I got it right here. Oh, oh that's me. That's it's right. actually, yep, it's about to go through a facelift. Yeah. So this might be the last time it, sh- it looks like this. So that's why you do coding? So you can do yes. your website? Yes. Okay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. What's the what's the, um, what's the the pros of having a website versus... Well, what's the difference between having a website and a OnlyFans? Like fans? OnlyFans? Yeah. Okay, so OnlyFans... Um, <clears throat> It's kind of up to the host of the company to keep your site up and running. So, say OnlyFans decides to go down for, you know, whatever reason, like, you're shit out of luck. Like, if that was your mainstream income, you're shit out of luck. Yeah, sometimes that shit do be, like... Um, sometimes they boot people off for their sexual content. Yeah. Um, they come with a lot of um, rules and, like... Um, what's the word I'm looking for? Terms of terms and conditions yeah. um, for your content. Like even now, like OnlyFans is having a hard time keeping the creators because they are not allowing squirting because they're like, it's piss content or a squirting content. We don't give a fuck. None of it. Um, so it's like, what the fuck am I supposed for to a natural, do? A natural um, body function? Is, yeah. So they're like, crazy. not allowed. No, won't have any of it. Um, so having your own <laughs> site kind of allows you to be able to post what you want. Um, and then, yeah, just be in control and, OnlyFans has a, a decent, like, percentage, I would say, like, payout, but it's still too much for the fact that they don't really provide much, to be oh, honest. Okay. Um, having my own site allows me to kind of have everything all in one place. Um, so, like, my wish list and, you know, Skyping me. And, yeah, like, I got a store. Uh-huh, too. you could tip me here. Like, you could buy some of the scenes, which I need to get up on is, like, a lot of the scenes that are available to my members aren't exactly in the store here, which I need to just kind of update that. Um, so yeah, like when you buy things out of the store, you could just download it and watch it whenever. Um, if you remember, you could just watch any video whenever. Um, but everything drops on my site before it goes anywhere else. So if you catch my videos on mini vids, it's probably because it's been on my website for a couple of months. Um, okay. it's like the first place, the place that gets everything first. <laughs> the name uh, professor is hilarious. Oh, he's, yeah, he's cool. <laughs> His name's the professor. He's cool. Damn, that's going to be my porn name. <laughs> <laughs> The professor? You could be the nut and professor. The nut and professor. Yeah, way. he's not the nut and professor, so you could be that. Oh, the nut? He's not? No, he's just the professor. Oh, the nut and professor? Yeah, you could be the nut and one. Yeah. He was, was going to wear a lab coat? Yeah. Oh. Got to have, <laughs> have a gimmick, bro. <laughs> you got to have something right. What's your, what you feel like? We're going to watch something, but what's the, what you feel like the most popular video on your website oh, is? Oh, boy. That you get all the feedback. Oh, fuck. Yeah, like what's your most Recently, your highest rated at? film? I um, was on here. Yeah. Which one was it that was going crazy? And I was like, why? Um, hmm. Click somewhere. Um, Bones Montana <laughs> always goes hard with me and his, his scenes always go fucking hard. Mm-hmm. Um, and then. Clapped in the closet is hilarious. Oh, Clapped that's a good closet. one. That's People enjoy title. that one too. Artemis is fucking amazing, like creator. He's definitely one of those professionals <laughs> that I will work with anytime. You had him on those leopard booty cheek outfits. Which one now? The, you had him on those leopard booty cheek outfits, but like you got one, like you got a whole leopard suit, but then you got that one booty cheek that's sticking out. That right there. Now they look floral. For, for clap. Oh, in the that, I'm wearing like a crop top. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. I thought she was I know, what, yeah. I know what outfit you're talking about. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's, yeah. That's, yeah. That's, yeah. Shit on the order list, bro. <laughs> um, people really like the um, that BDSM scene up there with Big uh, Max. Uh, a damn good slut. Yeah, that one. People like that one, <laughs> like the BDSM stuff. Uh, it's like an old dude, like yeah, he is older he got an old man beard, <laughs> mm-hmm. bald. That's my granddaddy. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, but when I say about old good. bald niggas, yeah, bald you niggas did. With beard. You, called yeah. It. Yeah. you called it for man. real. All right, we'll, got some we'll, real freaking them. Out of all these, we want to click on one. We just watch a little bit of one. Um, Let's watch the whole thing, bro. Now somebody should like it. We can watch minutes. like the the trailer for Clapped in the Closet. 
for sure. <laughs> yeah. Let's Slapped watch that one. Right. Yeah. <clears throat> It's like uh, I didn't realize I posted PP train before, like right after that. I was going what? crazy that month. A PP train? Yeah, a lot of bunch of people in the house just run through and piss on me. That's the whole twenty six minutes. Three. You're supposed to do like a R. Kelly type cosplay, though. I can't. I don't respect that, man. Oh yeah, I understand. Respectable. I respect it. Really smart for a space. So yeah, we basically had um, Samaj, who was another content creator I work with a lot. He filmed this for us. Um, we saw the, the closet and we're like, we could f in this. It's, it's big enough. To f and we're like, all right. When I see small spaces, I'm like, man, I probably get f in here. Yeah, basically. <laughs> And then, like, I'll have all of my all right, shirts. So, yeah, you spoke like a, you spoke, are you a real estate agent? So, basically, our real estate agent, like, let us walk through the house and, like, it was like, all right, let me know what you think, like, when you're done looking. And then we basically get into it about, like, closet space and, like, no, I feel like I should get this side. I like, no, you don't need to put the closet type shit. So, basically, got down to it. We're like, all right, fine. We'll, like, fuck for the closet. Like, whoever nuts first, like, loses the closet. Who's the um, clothes? And I think then I we fuck in the closet. <laughs> this, is some, um, this is some quality acting. <laughs> it made me get in the angles. <laughs> That's what I was like. That made me get like, yeah, the angles, quality, bro. He's a quality cameraman. That's yeah. Like, yeah, he, he definitely goes hard So, like, was he a fun to y'all? Like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he be going in for the angles. Oh. He shoots a lot of his own stuff, too, and looks really good. He's I just ain't got for enough. That reason. I ain't got enough trust, because if you was the squirt, I mean, I ain't gonna complain, but at the same time, like... Ah, yeah, I just I just bought this shirt. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> nice. Risk it all. That's why you gotta wear a raincoat. That's <laughs> is that. Have you seen that happen? If you know, if you know the content creator that you work with, like you know she's gonna squirt, so you wear a raincoat. No, so there's some content creators that uh, we know for sure are gonna squirt, so we take all the sheets off the fucking bed because oh. somebody's got to sleep there later. I've been there um, so yeah. So that's a lot of times like the extent we go to, or some of the real squirters they bring their own like waterproof bed sheets. <laughs> Wait, um, they got waterproof bed sheets? Mm -hmm. Where are you getting them? Amazon? Anywhere, yeah, Amazon for sure. Like, like sport up. sheets, it's like a good brand. Um, just gave me an idea. Mm -hmm. Um, so you can like piss on people, or you could just like squirt it or just like nut all over it, and then just take it off and like rinse it off and wipe it down and use it again. Fun fact, did you know in some smoke shops when you buy, you know, tobacco and stuff from you know they sell fake pee for that? Yeah. Some fake pee to use for that? Oh, I didn't know that. like for oh, drug wow. tests. I would never drink that. I'd rather just drink No, pee. I mean like they got, they got, it's, it's separate. Like you got uh, the pee for the drug test uh -huh. and you got the pee that people use for content. I didn't know oh, that until the guy that told me. That. Yeah, he told me that. He was like, yeah, this, this is the pee we use for, for OnlyFans and shit. I'm <laughs> like, huh? about this part right here. So my face against the carpet like that, yeah. I love to steam. <laughs> My makeup because my face was pressed into the fucking floor so hard. Oh wow! And so the host of the house, like after we we're done shooting the scene, he was like, "Oh yeah, like what'd you get done doing?" And we we're like, "Yeah, we just got done fucking in the closet." And he was like, "Oh cool, cool. Um, what the fuck is this?" And I was like, "I'm so sorry, I'll clean it." I was like, "I'm so used to cleaning like my fucking face off of fucking things. Like I swear it'll be gone by the time you come back." And he was like, "Yeah, I trust that it will be." And I was like, "I'm so sorry." <laughs> but yeah, the scene like him, my face dragging across the. Carpet. Well, at least you didn't lose a lash. I was, I was actually about to say you got rug burns from your face on the carpet. I have actually scars on my knees from rug burn. Fucking like these two, they're ma they match. Yeah. These two right here. Yeah, battle scars. See, that's dedicated because some women don't like it on their knees no more. And I'm like, why not? This is the best angle for my throat. But I'm definitely gonna be redoing my site, making some more, um, like, more interactive and more options to connect with me. There's some things I uh, am interested in experimenting with as far as like features. How do you pick who you want to do a scene with? A, a social some, media some, some and word of mouth. Oh, yeah. they got to have a platform first. Oh, for sure. Yeah, I see a lot of people. Or you got to have that. the dollars. Yeah. Otherwise, if you don't, you got to have the dollars. Like, yeah, some guys be like, man, you know, I see some women always complain about how guys might want to use content, but then they don't want to either pay the money or they ain't got no following. Yeah. So it's like, it's pretty easy. I'm, I'm a slut. Like, you can fuck me. Like, you just either gotta, like, pay me or fucking... Yeah, some guys don't want to do that. No. Like, that's so wild. Get tested. <laughs> that's and so weird. Like, like where are bruh, them? this is her job. Like, up yeah. I actually had a guy tell me, like, he doesn't want to pay me because he respects me too much. And I was like, but you don't respect your wife enough? Like, just oh. ring on your finger and 
you don't does she know that you're here trying to fucking that doesn't make fuck me and film it on that camera that doesn't make any fucking sense but you respect <laughs> me okay <laughs> Presenting. Oh, is that? Um, and Mother Phoenix. I love her. She's such a oh, sweetie. I thought that was Queen Rogue. Mm, mm, mm. I haven't I haven't worked with her yet. Queen Rogue is the goat. She did she did yeah. she, did, she wanted I know exactly what you're talking about. No, that's Mother Phoenix. Me, her I just want to see her real quick. She, has, she, has, she, has, and she has a crazy ass. It's amazing. Oh, Mother <laughs> Phoenix. I seen yes, her. Yes, she's got a dope ass. This guy is just the luckiest dude ever. Yeah, whoever for whoever real. He's a performer though. Chilling, that's bro. <laughs> So this is kind of the, it's a continuation, actually, and it's a different shoot house. So we did the Clapped in the Closet, and this is supposed to be, like, the sequel to it. And, like, we bought the house. We're inviting friends over to show off our new house, but we kind of get horny, and we get into it. Okay. So we start fucking, and then our Continuity guests arrive. Continuity. Fair enough. And our guests arrive, and the rest is history. Okay. I want to go to the part with Mother. Yes, you do. <laughs> so you just get into, like, a whole threesome. It's foursome, yeah. Foursome, foursome, yeah, yeah, yeah. So Stretch walks in and basically she's like, so, if you're going to fuck my man, I'm going to fuck your man. And like, <laughs> basically, like, we all start like. So so what do you do like, if a dude can't like just get it up while y'all trying to do this shit? We like, have to kick him out? I got to suck his dick or you got to like call it. We're going to call it. We're going to fake this somehow. That sound lit. Yeah. Uh, That's so, my baby. Salute. So um, I guess we're going to wrap it up. This is a good episode. This is way better than the last one. It's only going to keep getting better. <laughs> so when you, come like up, when you come out with that book, we're going to do that part. Oh, three, my gosh. Yeah. How, far are you, how far are you along with things with the book? I'm trying to figure out what to include and what not to include without getting sued or <sighs> fucking murdered. So, so, so you already got a lawyer and stuff set up with no, the book? No, that's, that's the main part I need to work on before yeah. I can start even like... So if you want to put some money in, but you got to hit them up and get their consent first. Oh, yeah, or I have to change the name yeah, enough. Do name. You do like what? Like, and I might have to come up with like a like a writer name. Change, like, change the name sounds a lot you easier. Do, you do what Superhead did. She she um she put different names. It's just everybody. <laughs> she didn't say real names the first book. No, she she changed their name. It's just like she used so much clues. Everybody figured it out, but uh, they couldn't sue because they didn't do the name. They didn't put their yeah, names. But I'm definitely gonna lose some friends and. Definitely have some people out here trying to fight me. Hey, it's your book. Exactly. Your book, your rules. Exactly. What they gonna do? Fire me? I mean, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, Gianna, go ahead and uh, promote all your stuff. All right, y'all. It's been good. Once again, I'm Gianna. Go by G. You can find me at omgiana.com. O m g i a n a dot com. Also, I'm on Twitter, Instagram. Um, as oh my Gianna O H M Y G I A N A. That that's where you can find me at. Be out here in these streets, being a slut. You probably find me out here too. And if you want to be in that gang bang, get them tests right. Get them tests <laughs> right. You see, she down for the shit. I am down, down with it. Clean dick, all of it, all fifty of them. Let's go. Right. Y'all slipping last time. Yeah, we, 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 try this again. We, we fucked up. Round two. Round two. We'll try this again. We're going to set up the Gmail this time. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Ario Penis. Yeah, Ario Penis <laughs> at gmail.com. I don't think it's that. We'll come up with something else. No, yeah, what? Yeah, she on a gangbang. Ario <laughs> Porn. We can say Ario Porn. Yeah, I guess. We'll Ario fig- Penis. <laughs> we'll figure out the logistics out there. We we're done recording. Anyway, this has been a, this has been a good episode. Return episode, REOP at night. With all that said, we out.